No, it, if it's itching for more than four days, Sam, you have to get a doctor to look at but it. But what if I, what if I intended it to itch for longer than that? Then you get a different doctor to take a look oh, at it God. for longer. Omar agrees. Yeah. He does. He knows, he knows a lot about itching. He's, a, yeah. he's actually a very itchy boy. You know? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah. He's like, Mom, don't tell him I'm itchy. What's wrong with you? you. Okay, what the heck, Mom? Oh. And no, you, it's okay. You gotta get a it's shot okay. every spring, don't you? Everybody's itchy. There's Everybody no itchy. camera angle on Omar, so we just look oh, crazy. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a oh, camera on him. Oh, <laughs> we swear he's here. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, here we go, oh, guys. It's that time. Here we go. I pick time. purple. I pick pink. I'll do this dark one. I'll pick what's left over. Yeah. Two, three, bless, go. Bless this dice. Higher or lower? Higher. Go, Whoa, boy. Me, Matthew. Yeah. Hey, that's one of my right. dice. I got a 15. Oh, wait, you already I'm rolled? one of your dice. Yep. And? Eight. Oh, three, eight. eight. Three, eight. Yeah. And a 15. And a 15. I'm the guy. I did not You're know. You're the guy. I'm the guy. Oh, you rolled that one? Yeah. Then yeah, then, oh, oh but Sam. No, I'm just saying, how did oh, that, dice that is get your stolen? Dice. It was just in the little, Here. it was just in the little thing. These so, are all oh, my dice. Did. The monologue for TikTok. Oh, oh great. God. <laughs> right, because we won't get it otherwise. That's the only way we'll get <laughs> it. <laughs> oh, do I do this? I go now, right? Yes, you do it. Okay. Stand on your mark. All right, all right. Sweet, okay, sorry. Oh, oh, wait, let me try this. Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. I'm Sam Regal, your 16th, ta your 16th tavern keeper. This is edited, right? You probably don't know me, and that's okay. I'm just a normal, regular, everyday human being with exactly 207 bones in my body, just like you. And just like you, I also struggle with normal, everyday human problems. That's why, when I have problems, I reach for a can of Four Sided Dive's good old-fashioned canned bits. Being flown in right now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> They'll put it in my hand and post. <laughs> but wait, Kyle's also running the prompter, so it won't go any higher <laughs> until he goes back. No, no, this is gold! This is gold! This is gold! This is gold. <laughs> Keep going, Kyle! <laughs> this is this the is best is episode we've ever done! This is the show! Now, <laughs> Now I know you. Now I know you think you probably already know anything about four, everything about four-sided dives can bits. We did this bit one lunar cycle ago, but last time we didn't have real-world testimonies from. Ooh, we're doing testimonials from real-world normal humans. Marisha. Oh no! I'm Hi, friends. Now. Hi. Let me see. Here. I'm. Hello. Oh, hello in return. Uh-huh. Did you know that before Matthew Mercer thinks up a wacky way to stomp me all over our hearts, he reaches for Jeez, a can. He's terrible on a prompter, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> he reaches for a can of four-sided dives canned bits. Y yes, I did. Anyone who is anyone knows that. It's common knowledge. I hope he talks about it on tonight's show. Me too. Now leave. Okay. We have another testimony <laughs> testimonial as well. Well, I'm really, I can't read. Why? <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? Uh, hello, friend. Hello, Sam. <laughs> hello to you. I was just thinking about how Sam Regal must have reached for a can of four-sided dives canned bits just moments before he conquered FCG's guilt by destroying an undead crow slash buzzard thing named Shithead. You're so much better at this than me. Can we say that on TV, Shithead? Nope, I'm leaving. You sure are. And lastly, come here, Matt. <laughs> oh boy, why? Oh, this is your line. <laughs> hello, huh? I don't know about you, but when I think about Laudna and Imogen's adorable relationship, I think about four-sided dives can bits. Their love reminds me of that creepy plastic Santa that follows Liam around the studio. Wait, what? Bye. <laughs> <laughs> and there you have it. Three testimonials proving that four-sided dives can bits are changing the world one canned bit at a time. Isn't that right, Mopo? Oh, I I'm sorry. Four-sided can four-sided dives can bits by Mafo are changing the world one bit at a time. Everything is fine. Welcome to Four-Sided Dive. Let's do a heckin' good show.
And welcome back. Let's begin the night with our open discussion segment called, What the fuck is up with that? Oh. We've got a lot of topics to talk about. I think shithead should be However, the first However, the most important whoa, whoa, emergency whoa, whoa, thing whoa. that we have to talk about is a mod and a hey guy. Nothing else matters oh except for us finally discussing <laughs> the most important thing of all. Hi. You guys, it's our, our resident lore and romance expert, Hi. Danny Carr. Hi, Danny. <laughs> Hello. I like your tribute to. Thank you. I'm I in know. full. I'm in full Amadna wear. Oh. It's great. <laughs> it's great. Amadna is the official. Is the ship name ship for ship name. Imogen and Lotna. Gotcha. Okay. That's pretty good. Yeah. Amadna. It's good. It also Very sounds cute. like diarrhea medicine. <laughs> it also does. <laughs> <doesn't laughs> really I like the the Southern Gothic. Ooh, oh, yeah, that's very good. That's actually pretty great. That's, that's less diarrhea-ish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like horse school. Horse school is awesome. Horse also. school? Wait, oh my you, god. I just made that up right. Oh my god. <laughs> that's so good. That's a good one, baby. <sighs> Oh, I love that. I'm gonna just be thinking of other ones all night. Yeah. <laughs> all right, to focus. Yeah. To focus on this. Yes, you do. We yeah. should talk about yes. Imodna. So, yes, what? Please. Tell us everything. How did it happen? Who knew what when? What? What is their sex life like? <laughs> in bed. That is canonical. Yeah. What yeah. spells can she use mid? Oh. oh. This is not entirely oh, about sex. Well. When did, when did I mean, you both? When, when did each of you know, as characters and as yourselves? I'm actually so interested in this because I. We did not talk about we this at all. We didn't talk about all. it at all, no. So at, all. At, the, at the character creation stage, we're going all the way back. Yeah. You guys <laughs> knew that you were friends, yes, traveling yes. companions, and you guys never said, hey, are we romantic? And somebody else I, was like, I don't think so. Yeah, or or think was it ever brought up? We talked about, we are not gonna be romantic. Yeah. Like we had had several discussions about, we like really wanna show like a solid platonic Female friendship. Like, <laughs> we want to show that that's possible. Yeah. <laughs> and it's not. <laughs> they fucking. <laughs> they were roommates. <laughs> yeah. Well, I do I remember one time we were in, we were like, I mean, this could be a path for them, yeah. but it's got to happen organically. Mm -hmm. Yes. And it's like in real life. And yeah. Not, yes. And not because people are demanding it through fan art. Yeah. yeah. Right. Right. <laughs> Yeah. So I remember being like, it's gotta, we gotta, it's gotta go. If it happens, flow. then it happens. Yeah. Correct. And then we didn't really talk about it for a very, very, very long time. Mm -mm. And then, like, I don't know. We were just like playing the game and like, I kept getting jealous. And <laughs> I was like, oh fuck, do I have feelings for Laudna? Oh, amazing. Like, seriously, like not wanting to admit it. And then like, not talking to anybody about it and going, I can't, I don't know, I don't know, is this really happening? Is this, I, I, we had those talks about we, we aren't gonna be romantic and now I feel like I'm, I'm going romantic and <laughs> it, was, it was just fully, like I didn't plan to say, can I kiss you in that moment? It was just like, well. It just happened. Yeah. And you could have said no. Yeah, yeah, I fully, that's the thing. I fully expected you to say no. Because, really? Yeah, because I wasn't, getting any sort of like romantical back. Interesting. Like, I, I just didn't think it was gonna happen. And I will say, this also comes from being friends and players for many, many years oh, yeah, yeah, to where there's yes, trust yes, in this. Yes. Caveats, your own home caveats, games. Sure. Don't do this in every Make home sure you game. you discuss this in advance. I know, I know. <laughs> and I sh but, probably should have. But, but we've been playing so long. We've been long, playing so long. Yeah. And, we, and we also and know it's our also fun to levels. surprise each other exactly. in Exactly. In a space where we all trust and are Thank comfortable. Yes. For bringing that up. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Consent, always important. Yes. yes. Remember yes. your consent. Henry Crabgrass. That's why I asked instead of just went in. Yeah, no, exactly. that's true. Well, I remember also feeling like very uh, jealous, also having like jelly feelings, like all the way back in like Bosserus when we were in Bosserus. Um, yes, yes. And then yeah, and then like you and Orm were getting close in friendship, and then we came back from being <laughs> split up, and like you and and um, Frida. Frida were like so close, and I was like. The fuck? <laughs> the fuck is this shit? Uh, and, and feeling like that. But then there was also the when I gave the pep talk. Like I, I, it was before. When was that? Was this the tether one? The you are my tether 
which one? Which you've given a couple pep, pep talks. Maybe, yeah, she gives a lot of pep talks. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all have a lot of conversations, yeah, and like, I need you to be more specific, specific. than pep talk. <laughs> I'm not I God. That thing. I just. <laughs> it was the one where it ended, and you were like, "That was the gayest thing." Oh I've yeah, ever that was seen. the. I am. That was the tether. Tether one. one? The, you're okay. my tether, tether. Yeah. and I'm. I'm yeah. happy to be your tether, and everything. Like that was that conversation. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all literally. Okay. So I have a girlfriend. <laughs> um, I have a partner, <laughs> and y'all literally walked off the set. I looked you both in the eyes and was just like. That is the gayest thing I have ever seen in my life. And I go home and kiss my girlfriend every day. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so please yeah. know that I did not push this on them or anything no. like that. No, it was just a comment from no, what I saw I in front of I me. I didn't feel like pressured. There was no outside influence on yeah, that. No, not at all. But it was yeah. very, it was very beautiful. When her, I'm it was. Sorry. No, no. I was going to say like when it happened on, on, in the in the show on the show, there was. I think you said, "Can I kiss you?" I don't. I don't even know anymore. I don't know if it's okay anymore. Anymore, yeah. implying that they had kissed before. No, no, no. So, it was like a huge thing that I had. I kind of mentioned it on a, another four-sided oh, dive that, like, any time that oh, you want me to show, <laughs> um, like. Imogen just always was inundated with thoughts, right? Yeah. And especially mm. if she was in a situation where her emotions were heightened. Oh, I don't, I don't, can't read you anymore. Right, sort of if her emotions are heightened, then she can't keep the wall up. I see. So she was always, one, scared to be intimate because you would know everything that you're doing wrong mm. or just whatever there was. Yeah. Um, and also, like any time that she would start to feel something for, in the, that way with um, Laudna, with Laudna, <laughs> that I would know where your thoughts were drifting. And if it yeah. wasn't what I was thinking, then there's no way in hell that I would pursue that. So right. in that and moment of finally partner. getting yeah. the... If you're thinking something, if you're feeling having romantic thoughts and Laudan over here is here thinking about potatoes. Oh, I have a <laughs> under my nail. <laughs> or my like, nail is falling off. Yes. Or, you know. But also if you're like walking down the plaza and Laudan is like, Ooh, she's fine. cute. Like you're gonna hear that. Yeah. You're gonna hear everything. You're gonna hear every little, yeah. little like, it's, like yeah, if, it would be awful. If you guys have a little tiff, you're gonna hear all the Lodna ways that you like, were wrong. Oh, yeah. She's being a bitch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. This is fraught with peril. Oh, God. But you have Honesty. Now you have the circlet. <laughs> I like it. I like it. The circlet. Hence the circlet. And as soon as I got it, then the party got divided, mm -hmm. and. Um, <laughs> So she like basically got to experience the world away from you, yeah, without being inundated with everything. So like yeah. to be able to come back to you and not have that in her head was really important. And since that moment, uh, we've gone. We've had a few episodes, I think, since since that moment. Hi, behind the scenes, off camera, is the relationship progressing, developing at all? Is it still sort of early phases? Are they steadies? Are they? Or what's what's the they what's want to the define status? everything? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Once we haven't really talked about yeah, it though, we we're haven't. just kind of still just like going with the flow. Yeah. Y'all refer to each other as girlfriends. You yeah. called her your girlfriend to check. I mean, yeah. like we're. I gave her a ring. You, you know you what gave I her mean? Ring a long yeah. ass time so ago. it's not like I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go see other people in addition to kissing you. You know what I mean? It's like yeah. so it's kind of I don't know what Laudna's thinking. Ha <laughs> <Lana>. circlet. <laughs> Lana's also, she's so like, she still kind of has a little bit of those like kind of juvenile tendencies. So I think she's like, she's not trying to keep it a secret, but we're not like openly advertising it either. Right. I was going to ask about that. Like what was the, so far you've only told Chetney. Chetney. Yeah. So, which is a hilarious one to be. Yeah. Chetney has learned first about so many of the relationships. Orem, he was the first person that Orem told about Will and mm -hmm. I love other than like fun. He's sneaky and he's also one of the least like, I don't want to say dangerous in this sense, but like he's, yes. he's the most irreverent to the point where you feel the least impactful in giving that information. Yeah. To yeah. Him. Which is great. Yeah. It's like, you can't judge me. Yeah. <laughs> Look there's, at you. There's comfort <laughs> in yeah. the fact that he is a train wreck. Yes. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry to do it, like, Chetney is such a fascinating character for Travis <laughs> because on the surface, he is he's a joke character. He's a, like, you look at it, you're like, I mean, when he gave me the, the character, when we started the campaign, I was like, oh. okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to make this go for a whole campaign. All right. Um, 
but it, but it, in, to that point, Chutney has become this kind of, he's this very specific, like, deep in his own weird way, wise in his own weird way, kind of like lived long enough, seen enough to the point where he's looped entirely back from like, I'm wizened and have seen the world to like, I'm wizened and I don't give a shit. Yeah. Yeah. And it's like, it's, it's how I want to grow old. I want to be Chetney when I get old. Yeah. Um, and it's very <laughs> soulful in a lot yeah. of strange ways. Yeah. Yeah. It's Chetney Pockapi, very soulful. <laughs> dear people. <laughs> <laughs> but we gotta, we gotta have things to aspire to before we <laughs> finish the chapter of our life. <laughs> yeah. I think it's funny, he's kind of, um, I feel like he's kind of like the core of the group. It's just like so weird to say, but yeah. like everybody kind of circles around Chet Chetney. in a weird way. No, For somebody coming in like last, right. I yeah. feel like he's like this weird glue. Chet and Orem awesome. like, are an unlikely pair of like odd leadership duality. Yeah. Like Orem is the, is the front of the spear, you know, uh, and kind of like the, the, the heart of courage, mm -hmm. and Chetney is kind of like the, the the wood? Weird mother, <laughs> yeah, the, the weird wood that holds it all together. Yeah. The weird wood. It's Chetney, the weird wood. <laughs> what about okay? But back to a yeah, sorry, 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 I'm sorry, I, I keep interrupting you. I feel like I, no, I was just gonna say, My what about giddy yuck? Giddy yuck. Giddy what? Yuck? <laughs> Don't instead like of that giddy up, yeah. Let's instead giddy of giddy yuck, up, it's no. giddy yuck. Have you been sitting over there thinking about this That's this whole time? <laughs> When did when did when did Laudna know? When was it the moment that she asked, "Can I kiss you"? Was it before? Was it was feeling she was, when she was feeling jealous? I think like, there's also like those jealousy moments, but then also probably like that in that you were my tether pep mm -hmm. talk, and I and I think there was was it the same one? God, it all fucking blurs. Where it was like, hey, if you don't want any part of this. And we just want to like rip cord and go and like find a fucking farm cartage. Same conversation. I think it was the same conversation, or they were very we close to get, each other. We can just go, and it's like if you want like a quiet life, we can do that. We don't have to be like beholden to anybody or anything. Um, and I mean, from the beginning, Laudna's like sole focus has really been like so heavily invested in Imogen's future in trying to like protect Imogen and specifically protect Imogen from the shit that Laudna has had to go through and see. Give and her a better life. Give her a better had. life than, than I had. Yeah, has been so much of like, really Laudna's driving focus, mm -hmm. so. And yeah. the best life you can give her is one where you love her. Aww. Aww. Damn. <laughs> um, who is a better kisser, Imogen or what's his name? Whitestone Greg? Whitestone Andy? Whitestone Andy. Andy. <laughs> I don't think y'all kiss. No, well, Whitestone Andy was mean to me. Yeah. I yeah. Thought yeah. They, yeah. But I thought they were like a little cute together first. No, no he, she just liked him. No, she had she a, it was unreciprocated. Got it, got it, got it, got it. She had a crushy and. And then he threw dirt in her face. He threw dirt gloves. That's so sad. That yeah. Sad. So then you're saying Imogen was better. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but let's yeah. talk about the, Okay, so the ring, yeah. the, the snake ring. Yes. How much of that was, and then like later on, you had the conversation with I think FCG or Frida, where you were like, yeah, people give each other rings when they're wed. Did you think about that? I did not. <laughs> I did not think about that ring when I said that to you, because you were gonna eat a ring. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Wow. Oh. <laughs> um, <laughs> No, I don't know. I just I played like, my truth. Saw the ring and thought of Laudna and wanted to get her a wanted to get her a, a you know I still love you. We may be fighting, but I'm still thinking about you. It's kind of oh, I love that. I also just I'm just very obsessed with how this relationship did uh, progress over all of these episodes. Cause it's- Yeah, it's been a long- I know. Slow burn. And mm -hmm. because like somebody who, again, I have uh, I have a partner and I we started also as best friends. Like y'all are basically living yeah. Brie and I's relationship. Oh, I just yeah. smacked my mic. I'm so sorry, Chris. Um, <laughs> and you're Southern and she's kind of gothy. It's true. Oh my yeah. god. She's kind of 
a spooky girl. She is a spooky girl. I yeah. love her. Um, she, do do it's uh. it's beautiful and perfect um, because we started out as 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 uh, best friends and spent all of our time together. She lived in another state, and then we were just like, no, but I'm crazy about you. After like three years of yeah. just not being able to go longer than six weeks without seeing each other, she was constantly flying down here. Um, luckily, the flights between Seattle and LA are not that expensive. <laughs> <laughs> but it was basically the exact same thing of just like, oh, I just, you're the only person that I want to be with. Right. And I, it's I been hilarious know. watching this because I'm just like, this feels familiar. Yeah, it's kind of tracked <laughs> in the same way. I, oh my God. He's so, he so much stop petting he's, him. Fart? He's no, no, he's, so he's, so he's blowing his coat. He's blowing his under coat. Yeah, you're going to be covered in um, black. About riding dyed saddle. Ooh, because she died. Riding dyed Died saddle. Continue, wow, these to, are, they're getting worse. With, like, guys. <laughs> yeah, they're I was trying to come up with like a death becomes her sort of a thing, but I couldn't. I couldn't crack it. Oh, oh, we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. Yeah. <laughs> We're Mural okay over here. Street? You guys keep talking. <laughs> mm. No, bad, bad, very bad. Mm. I used to be very good at this, and I'm no longer. Um, will this will relationship affect uh, your moves in the future? Will Will you be um, less wary, or less, uh, uh, more protective of each other, or not want to go go to to the moon because it might jeopardize somebody? Or mm. I don't know what. Will this affect things? Or are they, or are they just you, a together or not at all? What, did he make a face? Did he make a face? I was looking at Sam. Did he make a face? He's just. He, I can tell he's absorbing it. He's taking it in. He's gonna do she, I, she your favorite again. He's gonna oh, pull one of those. Moves. Wait, no. Oh gosh, we didn't talk about I, that. I, I was just waiting for two to be like, you know what? Yeah, let's just leave the campaign. <laughs> <laughs> Sam Regal. You're right, Sam. <laughs> yes. Wait, we haven't met mom. Yet we saw mom. You never met her. Your you, mom. Oh, you I guess that's true. From a distance. You saw her. You've talked to her, yes, but the, yes, yes, the rest yes. of the group hasn't met yes. her. Yes. Oh my God. So Lana has, so. hasn't met your parents yet. But she <laughs> saw her because she was in my head. Yeah. And we did meet we her may, dad. That's true. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So maybe we should go back and introduce her properly to dad. To well, dad. Yeah. Yeah. Because well, we I were... give a fuck what he. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. You don't have yeah, to introduce people. You don't have to introduce partners to parents that don't give a fuck about you. I'm sorry. You just don't. Yeah. True. Truth. Um, I'm not saying that Revan doesn't care about say. Imogen. No, yeah. I am saying that he has a funny way of showing it, he's and he has dead. a complicated. He's they have a, a complicated he's relationship. Not a yeah. No, he's not he's a bad dad. He's also not a good one. <laughs> yeah. He's just a dad. He's just yes. a, well, I don't want people to think that I am saying that he's a horrible person. I'm not saying that. No. He's fully one of those parents where, like, <laughs> it. He doesn't know how to handle the child he ended up with, yeah. and doesn't yeah. know what to do with it. So his like. His Response. heartbreak He's affected yeah. his yes. relationship with her too much. Yes. Correct. And that's very sad. And I have a lot of sympathy for that. Yeah. Like, it, it kind of reminds me it's of, you know, like if you love someone so much and you expect to have a life with them and raise this child together, yeah. but then they're gone. Yeah. Like, it's hard to, I would imagine it would be so hard to not let that grief overwhelm you. Yeah. Like, there's and a lot of sympathy. It wasn't even like a grief there. of like, this person passed away. It was, she left. She, left. she just went she just away. Left. Yeah. It's very sad. Yeah. I have, yeah, I, I, my heart breaks. What a comp, that's complicated. Yeah. It's a complicated relationship. Yeah. But yeah, I don't know, in terms of like future things, I've been, I, mean, I was actually just talking with Danny about this earlier, a lot of <laughs> stuff that I don't want to spoil, but I think, I mean, there's always like the protectiveness. I don't think that's going to go away. If anything, it'll probably just get kicked into like full throttle. Um, and even in terms of like how far I think Ladna might want to like push herself. And they both know um, now that we'll see. Y'all both know now that probably, that not probably, we know now that Delilah's back. Yeah. And yeah. how does that color things? You're now totally. properly in this relationship, but Delilah's back in your head. Mm -hmm. So how is that feeling? Which I there's been so much shit. It's been nonstop that I I don't think I've even told you in game yet. Yeah. I, I mean, we I talked about You talked her about it a bit, bad. but you haven't told yeah. her it's confirmed yet. Yeah. But that was very recent. I think it's been like a day. But that's not because you're withholding secrets. That's no. just because it's been crazy. It's just been crazy. It's just been, it's just been like moving from been. place to place. Yeah. It's been very like back It's to also back. hard to find the time in a D&D &D game yeah. to be like, let's have a sit down and yeah, discuss our emotions. Let me update yeah. you on Especially things. Especially when stakes are so high and you know that like, that anybody watching already knows those things. Exactly. And so when we're filling each other in on details that like the audience already knows, totally. but 
we should know those things. Yeah. 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 I also imagine, again, they sleep in the same bed. I imagine that There's you guys like off, have off a lot of yeah. off camera conversations. Yeah. Yeah, but also, sure. if you feel like you have to convey something yeah, to the other that. player, you it's brought it up. So oh, jeez. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. What did you say? Do they There's use spells when they fall? <laughs> That's all I want to know. Top or bottom, sorry. Oh, What's God. up? Do they use spells when they, when they're intimate? If oh, look, I yes, yeah, I mean yeah. If yeah. if I had magic. I'm sorry, would, you would, you, would you not experiment? You no, that's what I'm saying. Like, tell a, tell a, tell a in the bedroom. <laughs> oh you can do whatever you want. Yes, well, thaumaturgy. Great. Flying. Ooh. <laughs> Shocking grass. Oh. oh! If you can control it. Like this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying, there's a lot of, there's a lot of uses. There sure are. Yeah. <laughs> I don't you have your spell lists in front of me, but I could probably think of things. <laughs> Dude is nasty. <laughs> Mage is <God>. fuck. <laughs> Can um, I make that a shirt? Yeah. Yes. Mage is fuck. <laughs> uh, I'm supposed to be the host. Should I move past this topic? I mean, I would love sure. to stay on this topic, but that's up to you. <laughs> also, please, about. as always, this is not. This is this is not for uh, whatever y'all want to discuss. And I will. I will move away. As no, it seems no, you that we stay. are. Feel free to stay. Oh my no, goodness. He's not. He's not. Shed his coat. Away. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. His coat. Oh no. Oh, God, Don't buddy. move away. It's just Jamie. covering the table. It is Oh my God. Um, other things we can talk about tonight. Okay. <laughs> so much has happened. Uh, we saw Keyleth, your other character. Oh my God. Keyleth. And went to Zephra. Yes. Um, and <laughs> written, written here on the menu, menu is Taint Blossoms in Demon Land. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> it's a How perennium. Did it How did it feel to make that mistake? Honestly, at this point, I'm just numb to it. Like, <laughs> the, when, that was what, a pretty big blunder. Oh, no. No, it was. <laughs> it, that, that was entirely, I, I didn't spell it that way, but I, I full on, my brain just, as, you're, as I'm like looking down to confirm it, my brain picked up the wrong word, and as soon as it left my, my lips, I was like, oh, no. Oh, no. I have, I have sunk myself Paranoid. dramatically. Paranoid. Travis is calling you? Yeah. Do you want to you take it? On stream, baby. <laughs> is everything okay? I'm filming Four Sided Dive right now. <laughs> hi, Travis. Hi, Travis. Everybody says hi. <gasps> hi, Ronan. Oh. Oh, tell me, what is it? Ronan just started kindergarten. Oh. You guys. Are you there? <laughs> it's a mon monumentous time. This is. <laughs> This is the show now. <laughs> I love it. I'm here for it. <laughs> Check into the room. I'm so proud of you. Oh, oh. Good we, job. What does Ronan think about uh, the <laughs> Laudna Imogen <laughs> relationship? I love you so much. I'll see you at bedtime, baby. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs> can we, can we uh, in post, have you do his voice <laughs> on like a phone yeah. filter? <laughs> sure. Sure. Sorry about that, guys. I thought it was going to be something pertinent. Well, that's, it's what was that was so important. What did so. he? Did he have a surprise? Oh, he was just telling me some good news. What was his cool. good news? Was it, is it shareable? No. <laughs> 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 Not if I don't want Ronan to hate me when he gets older. Oh. <laughs> you let our imaginations run wild. Yeah. Um, oh, um, anyway, next question. So yes, funny. yes. So we were talking about. Well, we were talking about taint, but we were also talking about just the the visit with Keyleth. What was what were uh, what were everybody's reactions to that? I can I can say it's always yeah. it's been great this campaign to have these little check in moments with folks from past campaigns, yeah. um, and to see what in your mind they're up to or what they're struggling with and stuff. And Keyleth still has a lot of a lot of complicated emotions swirling around Man. her head. My favorite thing that Matt said was, I was just like, mm, mm, yes, girl, <laughs> was when you said, I don't remember the context, but you're like, I've, I've been, been angry, angry for I knew 30 years. Oh, yeah, I was like. So good. Yeah, it's so true. And it's like, the way you said it, I pictured Marisha saying it. It yeah. was like so. <laughs> that's that's me, me role playing kills is trying to like, Put myself through a Marisha filter. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, you did good. Yeah. I hope so. I hope so. It's always it's always super nerve wracking to be like, I hope I don't fuck this up for you guys. It's meant to be a gift for you and like sure. a fun it, thing. Everything you've um, done 
for previous characters has been so spot on. Yeah. yeah. So I still have room to fuck it up. <laughs> yeah. The pressure's but on. But it's, so, it's also so tragic. Like, you know, you, I hoped that Keyleth would always keep Vax in her heart. But she never moved but on. But sort of move on she at some point. She needs to. I know. I know. She's going to be she around so on. long. She needs to. I know. She can't fuck a raven. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she might Once be able. Again. She Maybe. might be able to. Wild shape. Wild shape. Wild shape. Oh no! Has she can that like happened? true polymorph the raven into know. a dude, she or just put a big old dick on the raven. You don't even know. If, <laughs> wait, okay. You don't even know if it's a an animal the best into part. a person. <laughs> this is like a Black Mirror episode, no, guys. Hold on. I don't know. Hold on. Black scrying mirror. What? But who's? Who? But but what? What if the whole time it's not? Him is a raven. He's just sending a raven to check on you. So it's just some yeah. random and raven. Just, he's just been fucking some random raven for years. And the raven goes back to its raven know. family and is like, yeah. I, I don't know. Like every three days, this lady just makes me fuck her. <laughs> go, go, goes back to like to, to the shadow realm and Vax is like, how is she? And the raven's like, she's fine. She's <laughs> doing great. Not much going on. Yeah. <laughs> Why do, you, why do you look like that, Raven? Nothing, I just gotta go. I gotta Big go wind. Take, Big wind on the way shower. here. I, I, gotta, I gotta get. <laughs> gotta go take a bird bath. Oh my god. <laughs> 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 we have hit two sides oh, of, uh, of relationships <laughs> with this yes. one. Oh no. This poor Raven. <laughs> We are discussing episode 69 for this episode. Yeah. So. Oh, there you go. Nice. <laughs> nice. No, it, oh. Man. Will she ever get over Vax? Something S wouldn't need to happen. Something would maybe still need to happen. Story's still being told. Story's but it was weird. also, I was talking with, we were, Danny and I were talking about this. Now it's even more weird. It's, it's like, like also things keep happening to not allow her to move on either. Yeah. He sends her a raven every he day. He sends her a raven every day. It's a little questionable. It's Vax. very Vax. Let's be it real. Is. It is. I Vax. love I love Vax so much, but also Vax has some unhealthy tendencies here yeah. and there. You know. And then he like we've like him bamfing to come in to protect her for that brief moment has happened before. Like you said, we've established it's happened before, which is okay. how they knew we could do that. Mm -hmm. Oh, but we don't know what instances that was. The assassination uh, it was, it was the assassination Zephra. attempt. Oh. Though, right, though, right, right, right. Right. though it's unconfirmed yeah, that, right. it's unconfirmed if Keyleth was, saw him then or was aware, oh. but Odohan did see his presence. We don't know the mechanics confirmed. of how that works. Like, is that something that Vax can, well, before he became a lens, is that something that Vax could will to happen? Or in those moments, does he have to go to the matron and be like, hey, can you make me? In theory, in, in, hmm, hmm. in, in theory, he's breaking the rules every time he does that. Wow. Ooh, does he get punished? Yeah. So he's not supposed to do that. Wait, what did you ask? Is it, is, when he manifests himself as a corporeal form in those yeah. moments, to he's breaking you, he's the rules. And so there has to be some sort of punishment or oh. consequence. Oh. Every time he does that, someone on Exandria dies. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't be some surprised. Some guy is just like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> he, he, he was uh, eating his oatmeal. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Back over here, like, just pressing the button you know, of that philosophy <laughs> question. Yeah, yeah. Hey, honey, could you hand me the paper over there? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Once again, I could see Vax being like, fuck it, yeah, worth it. <laughs> <laughs> fuck Gerald, I don't care. Hey, he, he just... killed that Nothic real fast. Yeah, he did. <laughs> wow. He's but yeah, I mean, there's... from beyond. <laughs> he can't, he's kind of still around. Well, was. They, was. <laughs> now there's this, now there's all this like God funny business too. <laughs> In terms of like, what are, what's what's the deal with the gods? Yeah. So it's yeah, she can't really. Move In a on. weird way, maybe this is healthy for Keyleth. Like she's getting a raven break. First of all, <laughs> her body can rest. <laughs> <laughs> but also, like maybe this is like the first time that she's been truly like alone and can. That's probably yeah. really hard for her. But maybe maybe it'll give her a sense of like, oh, maybe I can do this on my own. Maybe I'm okay. Yeah. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know. Um, other things Tripsy. that happened out oh, yeah. in Zephra. Fern made a new friend. 
Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. What's his name again? Danzig? Tevin. 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 Oh, I was like, yeah, Tevin. Tevin. Um, he was Tevin handsome. Dizzy. Super yeah. hot. He was hot. Probably the hottest NPC ever. Uh, we barely knew him. Essen. We met him. I mean, okay, y'all. You okay. met him for like five minutes. Y'all okay. know. Y'all know I love Essek. <laughs> Come on. No. <laughs> that was a lot. <laughs> yeah, it was a lot. It was everything you were giving, Matt. You were serving you were, yes. with were, him. Well, he look who he follows. Yeah, he's an he's an extension of the power of the Lord of the Hells. Like Who's like, it's it's, 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 it's meant to be a force of personality, chosen words, direct like, stare so into your soul really and take contact. a part with him. Like I speaking it. of, it was a lot in five minutes. Yeah, yeah. It, was, it was it was concentrated. We don't even know if we're gonna see him again. It was oh, we concentrated. We'll oh yeah, it's five Ashley's minutes. fern. Come on, I'm just like, saying. And if I, she doesn't do it, all of us will pressure we her into it. Her this yeah. is the campaign of giving everyone red buttons. That, yeah. That's that's my whole goal. Oh my God. Please push the zaddy button. Hey. Push the zaddy button. Hey, Delilah's here. Your chest's a bomb. <laughs> Your mom's on the moon. <laughs> um, Travis, everything. <laughs> like, just, all the buttons. Push all the buttons. Oh my God. Um, he got he works for the, the Lord of Hells. Yeah. Does that mean he knows Xerxes? Likely. Like, are they same level? Are they? They're different. Ooh. They're they're different. Positions within the hierarchy, or at least okay. their their utility to the Lord of Hells. Um, Tevin, I see as more of like a field agent, if that makes sense. Like okay. a, a, for lack of a better term, kind of a, a skunk works operative. He's the for... Archie Goodwin. Yeah, sure. Yeah. That's a '40s reference Tevin for you there, guys. Yep. Nero oh, Wolf. <laughs> no, I, it shows that you're 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 well uh, well cultured. Oh, thank you. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Sorry, yeah. the, <laughs> yes, I'm sorry. I'm gonna shut up. <laughs> <laughs> You're so much younger than all of us. Yeah. Um, we're, just uh, by, we're just my age. We are the same age. Yeah. Yeah. Is that true? Yeah. Danny and I are the same age. Yeah, yeah. we're only. I like think a you're few. like one, a few months. Yeah, younger we're than me. We would like so be it in stands. The same class. Nine, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we would have gone to like high school grade. together and been best friends. Yep. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. Might have been one greater than me. I don't know. Um, but, but in terms of the hierarchy, Xerxes is more uh, home base correct. admin. Uh, Xerxes, uh, in my mind, is is shackled to the side of Asmodeus, partially because of the the context of how that pact was made mm. was a major point in the history of like uh, Asmodeus' presence in Exandria, and because there is still a kind of. A, that, that burning kernel of goodness that'll never burn away. There is a joy in keeping him nearby mm. to watch him continue to suffer, really. Like, Xerxes? It's, yeah, Xerxes. Yeah, okay, but how is he shackled to the Lord of the Hell's side? In a sexy way. <laughs> Definitely in a sexy way. <laughs> With fuzzy hair. Y'all, this comes. episode's horny as fuck. <laughs> 69. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. Omar likes it. <laughs> True. Oh, oh my. hey, buddy. To woo. Are we getting some, some Omar cam? I think right now it's, it's just, just staring of, at yeah. me. Yeah. Maybe fish eye of me. Yeah, I'll just move it so it's a little bit more on Laura too. <laughs> there you go. Oh, sorry. Thank you, buddy. Sorry, sorry. Back to oh, sleep. He's Back to sleep. <laughs> I love how every single time we put the Omar cam on him, he just goes to sleep. Yeah. I know. We, we get, like, it must be comfy or something, or maybe he just it, he or doesn't want to move. Yeah. And he's like, <laughs> he just gives up. <laughs> um, oh no. Other stuff to talk about. <laughs> other stuff to what the fuck is up with? Mm. Yeah. Um, we, uh, the party returned to Bosserus. Yes. Um, re reconnoitered with Dancer. There was a little bit of a, of a back and forth about which D character <laughs> we were going to uh, interface with. I'm sorry, that yes. was one of the funniest parts of this campaign so far. <laughs> I was. feel guilty. I definitely wanted to go see Dancer. Yes, you did. <laughs> and everyone was really, really against it, and I should have listened to the group, probably. Nah, but I, it's I your wanted, story. I wanted to, I needed some resolution with with Dancer. It was good. I and, don't know this other dude. Yet. And we got resolution. If we hadn't gone seen Dancer, we wouldn't have gotten resolution with Shithead. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's true. Yes, which that is was important. the most important part of the campaign. Yeah. Pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I don't know. Did I fuck up? Should we have gone to see Devaxian or whatever his name is? D, D two, D squared. I mean, don't look at me. I'm gonna get that answer. 
Did you have, did you game out a path where we did go see D? Loosely, yeah. Like I, 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 my job before each session is to try and like figure out a loose idea of where you, what choices you might make mm. and be somewhat prepared and then throw it all away. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. we when do you, some when you burn it all random the option that yeah. was not anticipated. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> I feel like, I'm just guessing. We, it, but neither were wrong. Correct. That's very generous of you. I think I, my choice was wrong. No, we got all the great things out of Dancer. Yes. There are yeah. different yes. paths. There are many aspects of, there are many, I intentionally put out threads that there are things happening in the world in all different directions. You can choose which thing you want to pursue or none of them. Uh, the Devexian path would have put you on a different way to possibly discover elements of this artifact or discovered you couldn't mm -hmm. or have to do something else to get to that point. Also would have put you in Wild Mount and there's things happening in Wild Mount that I've kind of, you know, uh, You mentioned some Dwendal stuff, there was, or uh, Dwendalian Empire sort of uh, Lud stuff? Ludinus was seen um, in right. Rexentrum, yeah. which is odd because you also saw him on the moon recently, um, but apparently meeting with King Dwendal. Yeah. Um, who Bell's Hells at least doesn't really know who King Dwendal no. is. Like this, those who have historical knowledge would know he's he's a prominent political figure in the world. Yeah, but um, huh. like but yeah. So like, there's all sorts of weird options out there, but they're all happening simultaneously, and it's up to you to decide what you want to pursue. Oh boy! And uh, instead of that path, instead of pursuing any of those important threads, we went back to Dancer. I needed drunk. resolution, and the worst part is I didn't get it. She didn't give me, uh, she didn't absolve me you from know, my sins. That's Matt letting you know you chose poorly. <laughs> no, so, I no, it right. it's letting you know that 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 a journey <laughs> towards resolution doesn't happen in an hour. But it needs to. That is such an FCG way of looking at things. Or at the end of the 22 of minutes, it resolves. <laughs> Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. Was he's thinking? I see he's been watching a lot of WandaVision. He's been, yeah, Sam's been in a writer's room for for the it's past true. four years, it's so true. he's like, no, it's got to be like, a button. I'll go resolve this storyline. Yeah. <laughs> nope. No. Um, Life in is messy. Um, yes. Also, it is. Matt, I will just say you definitely said the Devexian path, and I just want to point that. Out. <laughs> We what? know it's Devexian. Am I just gonna yeah. keep saying no to this point? We it's know absurd. it's Devexian. You were the one who just a moment ago wanted to be like, oh, I'm not gonna tell you, I'm just saying. I know. It's Devexian. It, it's, come on. We saw him, we saw his face, you saw his, your, his memory. I don't know how you saw his memory. If he hadn't already woken you up. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. But I whatever. looked this up, I looked this up, okay. I figured this out. Okay. That's right, because we, okay. we asked you about this. So I'm so yeah. sorry. From what I could find, going back through all of my notes, I tried so hard to find this thread. You looked in Imahar Joe's mind, and you were the one who saw D with the um, with like a, a bunch of stuff. FCG did not see D, oh, and see. but you FCG described him, D. <laughs> and so did Imahar Joe, and then when FCG. Send, did sending to him, he was using, FCG was using your description from when you saw yeah. wow. uh, I uh, D right. in Imahara Joe's memory. I am pretty sure that that is, I don't know what voice that was. I'm pretty sure that that was the, uh, that that was the path. If I am missing something, I am so sorry. You never that's missed anything, Danny. That is not yeah. true. <laughs> lore Keeper! We need like a Lore Keeper Ooh. sting. That's true. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we do. Yeah. You need to record a jingle very... for Lore Keeper. I will, yeah. I will. Please do, that would be um, Can I just use Hot Boy? We still have Hot Boys we Hot We have used. lots of Hot Boys <laughs> still. That's true. I recorded like 20 of them. You did? <laughs> it was a really late night. I feel like I've got, oh no, it's what the cord for the microphone. I thought I had like a fuzz in my shirt, but it's the microphone okay. cord. Hey guys, I think it's time to pull from the Tower of Inquiry. Oh, we're there now. It's a simple process. Step one, pull a block from the tower. Step two, we read the number on it. Step three, Danny reads us a critter submitted question that corresponds to that number. Step four, we go around the table answering said question. Step five, profit. Sex. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> 69. <laughs> and if the tower should fall, there will be hell to pay. Hell, I say, hell! Oh, sorry, Omar. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> In the form of a nasty little note nestled away in that box labeled consequences, way uh -huh. over there. 
Um, okay, with that in mind, uh, Laura, will you go please pull a block? Yes, I will. Mm -hmm. All right, see it. the first. We really should have we? pull out one of the numbers and change that number to 69. Of because course we oh, have we should have. We don't have 69 blocks. Oh, yeah, it's so like 52 blocks or something? It's 51, like yeah. Just block. pick some fun numbers so we get, that we, we like. get a second right. set. Yeah, 420, yeah. 69, exactly 69 yeah, like blocks. 66. Yeah, 66. 666. Six, six. Oh, oh six, I feel like maybe six, this yeah. was a bad choice. 24601. Uh-oh. Yeah. Oh, if I know, if I get consequences on my very first you block on this very full tower, it'll be really funny. It'll be pathetic, especially after our last time. Just they do it. did so well. Just really do funny. it. Take it. Uh oh, <laughs> <laughs> I chose poorly. <laughs> oh, it's all wiggling. Do it. Oh. I got it. I got it. You got this. You're Laura Bailey. Have you seen the video of the guy going? Whoosh! You can do hard. Yeah. And it like breaks Laura. it in half, but Try then it. drops. <laughs> <laughs> Diddy backs up. I'm yeah. so scared of Jenga, <laughs> of Jenga blocks, you guys. Oh. Nicely done. Okay. Oh, it's number 27. 27. And this, no. one's, this one's fun. They're all fun. They're all great questions. All right, great. Nine well done, Laura. Thank you. <laughs> uh, what do you, from J.R. Tekip, and then the pronunciation next to it is Cheddar Biscuits, but it's J.R. Tekip. I don't know how that helps. But from J.R., what do you think your character would do if they were suddenly dropped into the Age of Arcanum? Oh, that's a good question. Ooh. Well, my character comes from the Age of Arcanum. <laughs> that's true. Yeah. So he might be totally at home, although he doesn't really have any memory of it. So... But would you even have, like, a personality? Do I now? <laughs> <laughs> I guess I would probably see a whole bunch of other robots around and, and freak out that I'm not special anymore. Everyone I meet in this campaign says, you're so special and unique. I've never seen anyone like you. But FCG it's seems nice. like it's like getting annoyed by well, it, though. It was well, annoying, but now it's, I've sort of, yeah. I, it's, it's come full circle, and I'm like, yeah, maybe I am special. <laughs> also, <laughs> also, Chetney's been telling FCG like to start a cult. And <laughs> wait, he I, has. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait, he has. Wait, I've I, I've missed this. Yeah, yeah, and you were in once. between them. Oh, it was once. Yeah. Okay. Well, but I've been thinking about it. <laughs> 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 because <laughs> because fresh cut grass. Everyone he meets has said there's something special about you, <laughs> and uh, of our group, there's only one of us who gets to talk directly to a god. <laughs> And Chetney's out there saying like, I think, I think you should start a cult or something. You could. So I, I feel like FCG is oh my starting gosh. to buy into this. I mean, the current <laughs> timing in Exandria is pretty ripe. I'm just saying. Yeah, I mean, I guess you do have the makings of a cult leader. <laughs> Everyone. Oh no. Telling you that you're special and you have gifted what abilities. What would Frida say? about you trying to start a cult. Well, he better join or else he'll be smitten. <laughs> Smited. <laughs> he's already Both. smitten. Uh, yeah. <laughs> be smitten while he's smited. Mm -hmm. What would yeah. your characters do in the Age of Arcanum? Canum. It's pronounced Arcanim. Arcanim. <laughs> Perennium? Yeah. Uh, uh. It's wild because like Ladna always wanted to pursue a path of like being like a, a powerful mage and wanted to go study and uh, you know embrace her natural abilities abilities I yeah, she, no she no she has some okay. i started with some and delilah just kicked him up yeah got it yeah so yeah and that was the whole reason why matilda went to go, was like so intrigued by the attention from the Briarwoods mm. because she was like, oh, they picked me, like I'm gonna be because this. So special. Yeah, mm. she, was, she was like, oh. And she thought that that could be, and her parents thought that that could be her path to like a, like a better life and to like maybe get, you know, into like school or something like that to help with her abilities. Cool. So I think she would try and it might be like a good opportunity for her to easily kind of have what she always wanted or what was intended when she was a kid. All of it. Yeah. I think it depends on where in the age of our common too. 
Because I mean, yeah. the only views you've gotten are pretty much of like Avalier and mm -hmm. you know, discussion of other places. And Aeor, yeah. And Aeor. Um, but those those were the majorocracies that floated above the world of Exandria. There's a lot of people that lived down in the ground that had no magic and no access to magic. Right. Oh, sure. Like there was there was a, there was a thing. <laughs> I think there's like some places in Alexandria with the classes some issues now. Age of Arcanum was. Oh, that worse. sounds like yeah, it would have Oof. been terrible. Yeah, there was a. There's a whole lot that would be fun to uh, explore down the road. Oh. Yeah. Did, is uh, Ruidus? Uh, forgive me for not understanding fully. That's all right. Ruidus was around during the Age of Arcanum. Yes. Okay. Ruidus has been around for all of history. Up until it was discovered that the very beginning it wasn't for a brief period of time. Okay, okay, okay. That was schism time? Nope, before. Before the schism. Divergence. The founding, technically. The founding. founding. Okay. Oh my god. No, no. Sorry, I'm sitting right behind Matt, so I keep forgetting that he's just like right here no, and I no, keep answering okay. questions no, it, behind it, him. I'm look, so sorry. No, no. It's it, probably it, so annoying. I, 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 no, I feel like you're my JoJo stand. Like you're just like <laughs> part of the journey here. I'm just, I'm just cr crouching over your shoulder, yep, like, yep. yes. <laughs> Um, Matt, why don't you go pull pull one, uh, and we'll okay. keep the train running. Thank Fair you, enough. Jr. Thank you, Jr. Take your pay for oh your. Boy. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, Jr. I hope pay is like cool about us. I know. <laughs> like oh clowning his name for <laughs> for three weeks now. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, we That's fucked it me. up. <laughs> not, it has nothing to do with. I him. messed it up. Yeah, I'm yeah, so sorry. I'm glad Twenty. Twenty. <laughs> Put it here just to Agents make it. of chaos. Yep, make it oh real difficult. Oh my god! Oh god, this is terrifying. <laughs> the next one should be the bottom level. Saying, I, I, you gotta play aggressively. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Be aggressive. Go uh, go from go. at Applebee's Soul Cycle on <laughs> Tumblr. Nice. Incredible. <laughs> Shout out to Abria. Abria. <laughs> For all, including Danny, there are so oh. many quotable moments in your show. What's your favorite one-liner from any campaign? Ooh, oh. that's a good question. A hard favorite question. Favorite one-liner from any campaign? Any. Jeez Louise. Man, there's there's a lot of good ones. Pay. Hey. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Life needs things. Yeah, yeah. life needs things, things to live. live. You pooping. There's a lot of Taliesin mm, quotes. Yeah. Your secret safe with my indifference. I mean, everything Caduceus said. I hope that someday you'll find someone to mourn you. Yeah. Oh. The whole that yeah, whole it's... conversation with the dinner of Trent Agathon. Oh, like Caduceus, yeah. Caduceus was just like Taliesin was tapping into like like the deep wisdom that he he. He's has a re reservation on like it's it's oh it's love that makes people not fear uh, yeah. oh God. yeah fear what was it fear it's, is it's love that makes people it's love fear that makes people, make people yeah and he was like fear is the I don't know it was an incredible speech yeah, right whatever back. it was good <laughs> check it out um yeah basically like anything that we say is pretty <laughs> fucking great great I'm trying to think of like one free I mean yeah. It's, it's one for each. And my, the answer would change every single time I thought of this. Like, they're all so good. Yeah. I've been told of six. I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's so a good, good one. Episode one. That was episode one. It was episode one because wow. yeah, because I, I went Aww. back at one point to find like my first tweet or something that I had when I was watching the show, and it was quoting that. But it was oh. on my Facebook because I wasn't. It was on really on Twitter wow. yet because oh, I wow. had a Twitter. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Uh, um, how about one more question from the the tower? Okay. Um, Wait, just so one. I beer. guess I'll say Marissa. <laughs> you can make people do it again. You have That's the power. True. I yeah. do. But don't though, because then we'll do this all night. <laughs> <laughs> okay. yeah. Should I? Oh, can I have know. a corgi do it? <laughs> sure. Just, just, just see what happens. Yes. Him you're gonna, the, you're gonna suffer sure. consequences. You're gonna knock it over. No. That's okay. Let's see what happens. The ASPCA has not viewed I this episode. <laughs> oh, buddy, do good. Do good, you buddy. You got it, oh my. Oh, boy, I'm oh, excited boy. about this. You got this. Which one? Oh, oh my god. Oh. Yeah, no, Look that's, at him choosing. That's cute. Do you want that one, Omar? With your tiny little legs. Wait, you gotta have him do it. Have him do it. Okay. Yeah, he's got to get in front of the I, camera. This is absurd. <laughs> I can't. Can I get a close up? Okay, buddy, can you, you got this? this? Can you grab that? You got this. Can you grab that? Grab got it. This. Grab it. <laughs> Come on, boop it. Boop it. <laughs> boop it. <laughs> boop it. This is perfect, Jenga. Yeah, twenty-four. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Good job. 
job, Omar. Oh, oh good boy. Oh my gosh. Okay. okay. 24. <laughs> You did so good. He buddy. did so yeah, good. <laughs> That's an expert Jenga player. Yeah. The Tower of Terror player. What is this? <laughs> From <The> cinematographer. <laughs> <laughs> From JD. JD. What item in your inventory currently means so much to you, and why? It can be a magical item you are you are currently attuned to, or something a fellow player or NPC gave to you. Pate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Potato roller. Is he an item? He's, 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 he's a, a lot of things. <laughs> I love his voice. All, all the chat when he gives are great. Busted oh, yeah. that out. It was just, just <laughs> so okay. good. Well, as soon as he told me, like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this path where I can, I can give life to my, my, my little tiny terrible creation. And I was like, what is the worst possible voice I can think of that I can, that I can make her, or at least everyone around her regret. That she chose it's this path. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the circlet for me. Mm. Yeah, that's easy. It's good. I don't have much. You don't. You eat everything yeah, you I get, or things. you give it away. Yeah. You don't keep things. Oh, I think my pack of cigarettes is pretty special. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Flipping oh, that coin has meant a lot to you. That's true. That's true. It's sort of become my thing. Um, by the way, I heard this crazy thing. Maybe it's uh, not <laughs> real. Maybe it is real. There's this thing I saw on TikTok about coin boys. What is that? It's what like a phenomenon. Boys? Oh no! What are you uh, it's tell like us? middle schoolers and high schoolers. They call themselves the coin boys, and they they always flip a coin, and like they're like. Like two Live face? by the coin, die by the coin. And like the teachers will be like, are you gonna do your fucking homework? And they're like, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> and they flip the coin. No, they're that coin, is, that's they're not coin real. Boys. That is, ge genuinely there's no hope for the future. <laughs> we are. <laughs> but I, I feel like my character, is, my character that's is a an can, unintentional that's a can coin bit. boy. <laughs> oh no, you stumbled into a TikTok fad. I did. Oh, that's awful. Oh. Maybe you started the coin boys. Maybe I did. Wow. I did. Is that a real Do thing? Do the coin boys know that they're following us? <laughs> <laughs> a, a fake robot? <laughs> yeah. They're part of the. <gasps> Maybe it's that can a, be what your cult is. It's a cult. The coin the boys. Coin boys. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, oh shit. shit. I'm doing it. Oh, I'm no. doing it. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing it. Some of the change fingers like. Mm, I like this. Oh, I think Kyle added in the prompter is literally Two Face from Batman. Yeah, it's <laughs> true. It's true. Um, None of you can be Harvey Dent. None of you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you, JD. Thank you, Applebee Soul Cycle. Uh, and if anyone has a question, I'm not going to say evergreen. I object to that word. Uh, if you have a question for the Tower of Inquiry, you can enter it at critroll.com/tower whenever you'd like. Um, Sam has strong feelings. I have strong about, feelings. He wants more poignant, timely questions. I do, but there's no uh, way of doing that with our shooting hard. schedule. Yeah. But guys, I try. You do great, Danny. <laughs> so it's so not your Taylor fault. Taylor and I try so hard. It's whoever's in charge of the programming on our channel. What the actual <laughs> fuck right now? <laughs> what Celebrate the actual you. fuck? <laughs> oh my God, it's the flat white please all over again. <laughs> <laughs> you should explain that. Yeah, oh, that no, it's already explained. Joke. That's right, it was on the flash. It was a flash well, was, joke, but it was before that. But not that, explained. It was a slack joke, but it, even, it's not you even know, a joke. It's not even a joke. <laughs> Sam just made fun of me for my coffee order. Yeah, for no for reason. For no reason. <laughs> You're still a bully. Why are you bullying I, Marisha? It's love teasing. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's a satire of bullying, because there's no way Sam can actually bully anyone. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Shots fired. <laughs> that was funny. Do I retaliate? I'll need a coin. <laughs> um, it's so I, funny because we were just talking about how to deal with bullies yeah. before we rolled you camera. Say, what do you say? You, you were just like, say, yeah, oh, totally. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, totally. Yeah, totally. You got or me. run away. <laughs> <laughs> or, or what my son does, it pretends that he didn't hear them. No. <laughs> I mean, yeah. honest, yeah. yeah. That you know, takes a lot of power. You're stupid. Away. What? I'm sorry. <laughs> That's <amazing>. Bye. <laughs> it's, it's effective. Takes takes the power away. Yeah, yeah. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> um, and with that, what do we do now? And with that, let's slide into the deep dive. Uh oh. 
in a stately Angelica Houston-esque voice. Yes, Sam. Do your best Angelica Houston. Yeah. Does she have a distinct well, she's voice? Like, you do she's it. She's breathy. Right? And <laughs> Maybe you should do it. <laughs> you just never seen Ever After. Oh. Danielle de Barbara. There you there go. go. Sure. Would oh, you kindly a... provide us with a healthy supply of yum yum what's it's? <laughs> I'm really glad we're keeping yum yum what's it's. That makes me happy. <laughs> now we're going to take turns pulling questions from our tankards. And since I'm the tavern keeper, I decide who goes first. And that person will be me. <laughs> <laughs> How is F FCG doing having reunited with Dancer and meeting her new automatons? What does he think of them? Uh, we answered some of this already, but Dancer, we saw two new automatons, yeah, you saw right? Cookie. We saw Cookie. Would you please listen to the show that you're on? <laughs> Why do you care? You're not gonna watch it. I'm not. Well, I might watch this when I'm on this one. <laughs> Um, oh we met Cookie, <laughs> yeah, and we met Pussy Pussy Two. Pussy the Second. Pussy the Second. Yes. Electric Boogaloo. Yes, that one. Um, <laughs> Pussy the Second was the flying bird contraption, Correct. and Cookie was a crawling thing. Yeah, it was more like a, like a like a a moving tripod type containment. I love it. Assistant. I think Fresh Cut Grass was genuinely jealous that she, that dancer had upgraded and moved on, and found such cool new friends and didn't seem to miss FCG very much. But I guess FCG's just gonna start to like get over it. <laughs> Look at that, that's growth. I guess so. Oh, you're next. I mean, she yeah, she basically said like, you're just gonna have to get over it because you're not gonna get what you want from me. It yeah. kind of sounds like what Dancer said. Maybe, oh shit. I, I should have like talked to Keyleth about somebody like, from how do you get you. over not getting closure. Oh, you get Oh, yeah. Her answer would have been, I'm well, the wrong person to ask. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, we can't talk to Keyleth anymore for a while, can we? Well, wait, she's is she with us? with us, is she? right? No, she just, she just sent oh, you yes. through. Timothy Oliphant? Yeah, we oh, just. Oh, Tower of Terror, that was our secret word. Timothy? Oh. What? Oh. 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 What do I do? Is this like Pee Wee's Playhouse? What happens yeah. now? Sam, you must come and pull from the tower. Oh, oh, oh my god. Has this ever, what has this been a tower once I think before? Once. I was like, oh. I don't think I've ever been present for oh this, I, and I'm so I, excited. Whoa. I More of Sam's favorite segment. <laughs> Only one hand, one hand, Sam. Oh, you're you right. didn't do one hand, Laura. Yes, I did? I kept my hand on Oh, that's side. true, that's true. I was thinking fingers. I'm so sorry. You think I could that get was this very one? Rude of me. This seems not like it's oh, not going to work. Oh, jeez. I think you got it. You got it. You can do you it. You got it, Sam. It you already no. touched it. You can't. Wait, choose is that true? One. Is that the rule? That's how the rules go. Once you pull on it, you can't. Oh no, this is not going to go one. well. You got it. You, you got, got it. it. You got it. You got it. <gasps> oh! <laughs> it is a lean-in. Oh my god! Whoa! Oh, Why did y'all do this? <laughs> 47. Oh, no, you got yeah, it. You got it on top. Oh, that's going to do it. You You can do it. Oh my god. <gasps> wow. Wow. I'm so scared right now. Wow. Oh, this no. has to don't don't stop don't. it. Stop it. It's your turn. I know. He wants to do the consequence. Terrible. He does. Okay. From Lux. From the start of the campaign, the party has seemed very sectioned off into close groups of two or three. Mm -hmm. How do you think the party's recent split and reunion have strengthened, weakened, or rearranged the relationships or traveling groups which were created pre-stream? Oh, wow. How do you think the newer relationships were affected? I personally question. believe that <laughs> world peace. Was that a reason <laughs> to that question for you, Sam? Uh, Danny, it will do. I'm very glad. <laughs> that's, that one's pretty no, topical. That's a, that's a good yeah. one, that's yeah. That's a topical one. Um, could you repeat the question? <laughs> <laughs> Talk about the, it's uh, sectioned off in a close group. Group dynamics. Yeah, yeah. Group dynamics. split, how'd that affect y'all? I mean, you can talk to this, you speak to this too, you're, while you're watching this unfold. Yeah, but it was your I question. want your answers better. Yeah, 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 sure. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I want to see what you I think, say. I think it's been interesting to see, uh, at least from my perspective, it's been interesting that the the first group that sort of knew each other coming into this, Fern, Orem, mm. 
and Dorian. Dorian. The EXU crew. Um, well, Fern and Orem mostly, I guess. Uh, they still check in once in a while, but like I feel like they drift. They drift other ways now. Like Orem, yeah. Orem, and you get along uh, quite a lot. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Fern and Chetney obviously have a special connection. And Fern and Ashton have a really. They yeah. do. Mm -hmm. They do. I think some of, honestly, some of the dynamics of the show in the entire history of Critical Role depends on who sits next to each other. Yeah. <laughs> That's why it you mix really, it up from campaign. It really affects yeah. the relationships at yeah. the table. Yeah. Because yeah. it's it's just so much easier to have like an intimate moment with yeah. someone next to you. Yeah. yeah, I can barely see Taliesin. <laughs> Like yeah. he's yeah. way over there, and you're you're blocking. You're like uh, you and Liam are blocking it's him. It's really and... hard to have a conversation with Ashton too. For me, like it's hard. Yeah, because the... Liam is just. But like I don't know how. But that's bullshit because Ashley has like so many great moments with Ashton. So it's true. Uh, it's just my my problem. Yeah, you're just bad at this. I'm just shit. Well, she. This is <laughs> get me fun. off the show. Fun production fact Ooh, for you. production ya. facts. We actually, we think about the table setting a lot, especially when it comes to like, you know, just spit. I didn't see it. When I it didn't comes see, I'm, to, I'm that's to... good, <laughs> that's good. When it's it comes to like, um, one shots or people with guests, if you notice, we never put guests on the in seats Ooh. where Travis and Taliesin are sitting because when you're inherently on those, essentially the outside seats, most people's attention are focused inward mm. towards like where, you know, Ashley is sitting or where you're sitting. So the people who are sitting on the outside, we try to pick people who can hold their own, who can hold their own, 100%, and who we know will jump in regardless. And that's why be I'm not there. Because that's what you have to be the center of attention yes. right in the middle. <laughs> All the time. Are you <laughs> always in the middle? I, I feel like it. I feel like you've been in the middle on every campaign. Could be. Could be. <gasps> we put Travis on the end a lot because he's, he's also big. Because right he's now. bigger he's so too. Long Travis also prefers the end. Yeah, He'll he prefers you the like, end. You sit next to Marisha. I, like, I said this technically how the table works. Yeah, the yeah. table goes right, right, like right. this, and I'm, yes. I'm right here I'm in, the in the center yeah, of the yeah. V. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's in the in real time. So we always we rarely put guests on the outside because we want it, to. It's easier to engage because if you're on that outside seat, you often are seeing people's Back shoulders of yeah. facing away from you. Mm. That was fascinating. Yeah. Look at that, a Tower of Inquiry question that led us to so much more. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I misjudged the Tower of yeah. Inquiry. Maybe you should pull another one. <laughs> okay. No. He wants consequences. Oh he wants to do it. Could he you? Does could you do, do it? it? Oh my god! <gasps> All right, if one more quick one. you do this, Sam, this is a quickie. I don't think I can I'll do it. I'll respect you for the rest of my life, which is saying something. That is saying something. <laughs> Staying over here. There's no. There's way. no way this is gonna. <gasps> <gasps> oh, shit! I have to respect you. Where's what? Where's the Forty-three. That's part of it. If I put it here, it falls. Yes. If yes, I put it, it here, it stays. Correct. Maybe I'll do the middle. Okay. What? This carelessness. <laughs> that is incredible. Insane. That is incredible. <sighs> Rest of your life, Laura. Fuck. You promised on national television. Sam, <laughs> you're a talented point. genius. Wow, it's so sincere. <laughs> I, I don't care if it's not sincere, I'll take it. I love it. <laughs> From Emily S. If your character taught a class, what would it be and why? Oh, oh that's a good question. Composting. <laughs> 101. You can totally see Laudan at like the nature center. Yeah. Uh, just teaching yeah. people who come in. Like it's like a weekly like Wednesday night class. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think just breath work. That's great. <laughs> yeah. The FCG would good. do well in Ojai. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just some sort of meditation <laughs> class or something like that. Just yeah. using, using your chest cavity as a sound bowl. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe a baking class. Baking class. Yeah. I come from go. the South, but Imogen would be in charge of like the local FFA. Mm. What's an FFA? At the school. <laughs> Future Farmer. Future Farmers, Farmers of America? Of America? Yeah. yeah. Oh. That was big. They didn't have that, that at my performing Texas. arts high school. <laughs> no, they didn't. <laughs> uh, how about? Pick a character for me. I have too many. Marwa. Marwa? Mara would teach 
uh, scavenging. Ooh. Like dredging. Dumpster diving. You no, know, maybe. <laughs> no, but like 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 going like you know scavenging along the edges of water and basins or in places of historical value that aren't you know private like land and trying to find kind of? like foraging. Uh, like for f survival. <laughs> but for, for personal gain. <laughs> yeah, like like this is this is about the history. More like I want cool things to sell yeah. and or keep for myself, which I, I respect. So one of my big regrets about this campaign is we don't get to spend more time with Marwa. I know I, I loved love Marwa. Where is she? Is she? In, she was in Jusar. Yeah, we never go there. In the like the ship ship shop. I can send you back to Jusar if you want. Like, can you just send her to us? She's sure. awesome. Maybe she got jettisoned somewhere. When everything was Let's happening. Let's say that she's in the broken teeth or the shattered teeth or whatever they're called. We just run into her randomly. Yeah. <laughs> That'd actually be pretty funny. I'll think on it. <laughs> <laughs> um, what am I supposed to do now? I was reading a question oh, that I've been shit. holding for forever. Oh, I'm sorry. Because <laughs> <laughs> I said Timothy Chalamet or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Some of the piece of paper's like now been like twisted and folded. <laughs> Go on. It's All true. Right. Marisha. <clears throat> I know they just hate it when we read know, our names. It's, it's so funny to me. Lana <laughs> mentioned her interests in eidolons and primordials. How does she feel about these nature spirits? Why do they speak to her rather than the gods? Yeah, it's a, it's a great question. I think Lana will once again, and uh, we're going to have to talk about this because Lana was already like, I don't think the gods are down for whatever I am. Uh huh. And then you did that radiant or that turn undead, oh, yes. which hit me Hurt you. in a bad way. Mm -hmm. So I think Laudna, that's just further confirmation that like the gods don't like you. The gods don't like me. But I think for her, it's like, well, everyone is so conflicted. And then also when our group split up, our group was very heavily focused. Like you guys were dealing with like a lot of HR Farconum stuff and dealing also with people who are very like god-centric and then ours was the opposite where we were dealing directly with people who were like affected negatively mm -hmm. by followers of the gods so i think laudan is just like oh well if there's like another way we can do this that just doesn't rely on the gods again mm -hmm. then we should explore it and then it's also still questioning just kind of her entire relationship with the gods. Oh my goodness. I mean, Look, he's, he's moody. He's Look, just like twitching. twitching. He's sleeping. He's, he's dreaming. Dream. This little booty was twitching. <laughs> so cute. Laura Bailey. Oh, I'm <laughs> not disturbing the dog. Uh, Laura, what was it like for Imogen to confront her mother above Ruidus? How is she feeling towards Liliana now? I think she's gotten fucking sick of it. <laughs> she's. <laughs> that was so cute. <laughs> You're like, tee hee hee. <laughs> <laughs> she wanted so bad to believe that her mom had the best intentions and was looking out for her and like everything that she's experiencing is showing her that that is not the case. And um, it's hard because like me, Laura, I see it like, like I want so bad for Liliana to be good mm -hmm. yeah. and for her to be able to find that redemption. And I, I feel like when we had that moment with lewdness, when everything went to hell and I just didn't roll well enough that we would have been able to bring her over to our side. Um, and now she's so deeply entrenched with lewdness that um, I, don't, I don't think it's gonna be possible. But who knows what surprises you have for us. But yeah, she's, uh, she's, kinda, she's kinda over it. She's kinda over having that hope. That's depressing. Sad. Thanks for that depressing thought. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Matt has a very good poker face. Yes, he does. I've honed it on Travis for a decade. <laughs> Where he just stared. I you down. heard. Yep. I heard there that if you want to.
foil a lie detector test, you you like squeeze your sphincter really hard. Oh, like you really? pucker your sphincter. I heard that you just have to put like a tack in your shoe. You just step on a tack because oh, you focus. I think that's you, like, my secret. You just I'm always. always <laughs> I think so. That's what I'm saying. Like <laughs> I feel like <laughs> you're always clenching your sphincter. Oh, yeah. Wait, you can fuck up a lie detector test by. By like squeezing really your booty? squeezing your. There's a lot of ways. Like they're they're not admissible for a reason. Like a, that's old tech. <laughs> well, don't you think making that face would give right it now. away? <laughs> <laughs> I just imagine Sam in the middle of a deposition. <laughs> <just> like, <laughs> <laughs> like it's so much work. <laughs> the detectives are like, never mind. <laughs> Move on. I wasn't there that night. <laughs> <sighs> Matt. <laughs> this will be the. <laughs> I know. This will be the first time that the shattered teeth has properly been visited. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Not counting when it was dominus and calamity. Is there anything you're particularly excited about, or anything you can tease about the continent? I'm I'm very excited. Uh, it's something that I haven't had the opportunity to to really kind of bring into the game. It's a very different continent than everything else in Alexandria. It's Xandria. a continent. I mean, it they call it a continent, but it's it's a series of islands that are clustered together. And it, because it was once a continent, it's kind of historically and colloquially referred to as a continent. Mm -hmm. um, but it's it's a collection of land masses. But it's just it's a weird it's a weird space. Uh, there's a number of reasons why it hasn't seen a lot of attempts at uh, the outside cultures of Exandria to try and bring it into, you know, the modern political stream of everyone else in the world. Uh, the trade is challenging, and the people that live there uh, are unique Assholes. in their own right. Um, right. Yeah, the destruction, the destruction of Dominus definitely left an impact. And while the while it, the essence of the shattered teeth uh, is elementally tethered by the nature of that destruction. And isn't dangerous in the ways that, like the various rifts to the elemental planes that the Ashari look over are. Um, it is still a very chaotic place in how those energies affect it to this day. Mm. And that's all I'll say for now. It's fun. I can't wait to see it. We haven't been to a new place in so long. Yeah, like that's true. a truly. Yeah, we've kind of been. It, will this be the last continent-ish place that we've? Seen? Well, there's things. plenty of places in Exandria that you guys haven't seen. But I mean, like, are there any other large land masses that we don't know about? Everything that's been noted in current books is known Exandria. Known Exandria. Correct. But, like, so we could go to the other side of the I world. I was waiting for it. <laughs> I know we're not in session, but FCG just died. <laughs> 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 we start the next yeah, session. We'll, we'll just jump in right there. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want SCG's last words to be? <laughs> it was a play. <laughs> <laughs> Only if we can replace Sam with that that fake Sam that you got off of Central oh, Casting. Yeah. I love that guy. <laughs> gotta get him back. We gotta something. bring him back. Yeah, there's all sorts of interesting weird places. There's also like, you know, uh, beneath the waters of the ocean <gasps> and. Other odd, you know, spaces Water in the level. world. Like there's all there's a whole bunch of places in Exandria that we could eventually explore if we get the opportunity. That's true. Is there, there's got to be some, especially because like shit fell there's, out there's of the mer sky. People. And there's merpeople. And there's merpeople. Merpeople. Yeah. And, and, and we barely got into whole, the Underdark like, the whole area, area, right? Yeah. There's there's yeah. subterranean worlds. <laughs> all the so uh, I mean, there's a whole mermaid. Can we do a, do mermaid, a mermaid one shot mean? where everybody's mermaids? It's possible. There, <gasps> there's there's to participate in this one. <laughs> what? If, wait. Yeah. So. Uh, could, what if there's like fawns, like ferns, could there be like merfawns and you're like a deer head with a fish tail? We'll talk. <laughs> okay. We'll, we'll talk. Yeah, they're, they're, call, <laughs> they're called <laughs> abominations. Yes, yes. <laughs> so we yeah. know what Marisha's mermaid was whenever yeah. she would play oh mermaids with her friends. I, wanna, I already claim I want to be like a Ursula, but like a hot Ursula. Oh, oh, that's good. That's Ursula's good. hot. I, okay, but I want to be like. I get what you mean. Yes. Uh, sorry, I'm, I mean, are there like I, I love me my my divine, yeah. <laughs> you know, orbitons or just submarines? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Mermaids just wasn't submarine. enough for you. <laughs> yes, I'm just. A We're going too deep on this. <laughs> Gotta pull out. Oh, oh, I'm a jet ski. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh god. What's your question? Okay, my question, <laughs> Sam. 
Where did shithead come from? Was the bird your idea or Matt's? <laughs> it was my idea. Uh, originally, I thought that uh, FCG might have a animal companion, oh. an animal familiar. And so I had the bird designed and it was gonna be a familiar that had a love-hate relationship with FCG because <laughs> uh, the shithead would always shit on FCG's head, but FCG <laughs> needed shithead because it helped in battle and stuff. Um, but then I think I found out that Ashley was gonna do Fern and had Mister, yeah. and then you had Pate, Pate, and I was like, I don't think we all fucking need <laughs> animals. So, <laughs> but I already had this thing designed, and so I just I sent it in an email to Matt. I was like, just do something with this. <laughs> His name's Shithead. <laughs> That was it. That was it. I also love that his motivation was just like, I just, I just I don't, don't like, like him. <laughs> it's so it's deep. So good. It just bothers me. Well, it's like, what are those? What are those? Are they Australian birds like that just hate people oh. and they just like dive so, so bomb. Icelandic birds. Too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Kier they're birds. Not, not the magpies. Birds. What are they? In Iceland, I think they're called. Kier birds? I think or so, yeah. Like but that. magpies too. That's like, right. there's just there's just some animals just go, and and not just like <laughs> I hate people, but like a particular person will come by on their walk and they'll be like, everyone Ooh. else is fine, but fuck this person yeah. <laughs> in particular. Yeah. And so that I just love that idea. It cracks me up. About like like that girl who kept trying to thwart them on her bike rides to work, and she would have like yes. the helmets and would put sticks on it, and, like and the birds still... Bird still like wham. And she was like, ah! Screaming the whole video. Yeah. yeah, it's great. <laughs> but also, it's cool because it let me read That's into so it whatever I needed to read into. Mm -hmm. You know. <laughs> what was it used? Speaking of good one liners, you're like, it's a personification of my guilt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It is. To me, <laughs> everything's a symbol to FCG. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, should we go around one more time? Uh, mm -hmm. Speed oh, round? Okay. Uh, Marisha Ray, you're up. Yeah, because whatever we don't get to, we can get to during the game games. round. Oh, yeah. This is true. The game round. We will just shout questions at y'all. This is Please do. This is what this oh, work. What was it like? Oh, we okay. Yeah. What was it like? <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> 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 Marisha. <laughs> what was it like for you to see Keela so wounded and to go through a quest specifically to save her? It was so sad. It was like, oh man. That's my girl, she all fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's wild. It's a meta-ass campaign. Yeah. Yeah. To see, like... I figured it yeah. might be based on on you, specifically your character and Liam's character. Like, they're both characters that their history is tied directly to, like, campaign, campaign one, one elements. Yeah. So it was like, oh god, nerve-wracking to, to not mess it up, but also exciting to, to be able to bring that back. Yeah. You know, I think I said it before, but like, I've always dreamed about having multiple campaigns historically in the same world to have opportunities like this, and it's been really fun. Yeah, it was wild, because like, I think of Keyleth, I feel like a lot of us think of Keyleth as being so hard to kill. Yeah. She's so beefy and powerful. She always killed everybody in like the PVPs and yes, everything. Yes, yes, yeah. always made it to the end, and then she like, to see her get so close to death, it was like, sad. no. Yeah. yeah sad. Laura yeah. Bailey, speed round. Instead of the this planning, so it took to get her there, though. Oh, my yeah. God, that's right. Laura, how does Imogen feel about agreeing to plant the brood pit from the All Minds burn? Oh, yeah. What was that yeah. interaction like for her? This is kind of like, ooh, she came to the realization. I think when we when we were in the Gray Valley, that's when like, we were getting the perineum flowers, right? Perineum flowers, um, yes. <laughs> And seeing all of the demons like running amok and realizing the gods were the thing holding this horrible force at bay. And this is just one little bit of it. What else is happening in the world that the gods had been controlling up until that point? And like, she just hasn't had a lot of interaction with like deities um, in her entire life. It just hasn't been a part of it, and all of her powers came from something else. Um, I think she she kind of was like, we gotta put a stop to, we, we really do, at whatever cost, if 
it means being the end for herself, then that, that makes sense um, for everything else. Like, so when she agreed <laughs> to plant the little seed, I think it was a, yeah, we're gonna fuck up the planet anyway. So I plant this there. Yeah, maybe it helps us. Maybe it helps us. Worst case scenario, it'll be destroyed in the end too, you yeah. know? And, um, yeah, I don't think she, it's not like she had a problem with the giant mind weird oozy creature. You know, she's not scared of scary things. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, <Clearly>. yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I think she was more entranced by it. Cool. Oh, right. Matthew Mercer. <laughs> Last question of the round. I'll pick two, pull one. Read them both at the same time. No, that one. It's a little close to what you just answered. I'll put that up there. Okay. Matt, how do you feel about. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> <laughs> how, do you, <laughs> how do you feel about losing Ratanish in that battle? Oh yeah. Did you have more plans for Odohan's second in command? Uh, yeah, I mean it's always it's always a little sad to lose uh, a recurring antagonist character, even a low-level one. And for him, my hope for that encounter was when Either things would turn sideways, because if he was present for a lot of that battle, it would have been a different. For sure. It already, uh, yeah, well, it, it was, was already meant, dire. It was meant and to be a very difficult battle already. Which is why when you guys were talking about splitting up, I was like, oh no. I know, thank, <gasps> thank Keyleth. Oh boy. For, that's why you were like, I don't think you should go with me. I really don't think you should go <laughs> with me. <laughs> Keyleth's like, I can handle it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was awesome because I didn't want to have to bring a really powerful NPC to do the battle for right, you. Right, yeah. yeah. I was like, she's, she has other things to do also. Yeah. Um, she's she's not she's not your chaperone. Yeah. yeah. Um, but so the intent was to be a difficult battle, and he was meant to be either things rather than get bad enough where you would have to flee, mm -hmm. or if things were to turn enough and he could see it, and he can see it fairly early on, he was going to himself flee, mm -hmm. and he has uh, especially a move set to kind of be hard to chase, mm -hmm. um, especially through the city that he knows so well, and then that would have been a scenario where he would have been well aware of your. Proximity to uh, uh, ground zero. to ground zero, uh, yeah. uh, to your activeness, and mucking with their plans, and it, he would have. My hope was he would have then been kind of an informant to yeah, to, to bring attention back to you guys and kind of ramp up that nice. tension quickly. But you stopped him, so uh, good on that for what little time it'll buy you. Oh, oh, well, and he win. <laughs> wins a win. Also, like, hang on, because now that he's dead, because we saw him fight Ashton. Uh -huh. And he was doing barbarian shit, right? Yeah. But then he wild shaped. We know. No, was, that wasn't him. He didn't wild that shape. Him. That was the mage. Oh, that's right. We, he was he was yeah. banished, and then when he bamfed in, all of us at that's, once. Yeah. Oh, we that's oh, that's right. Him. That's right. Yeah. We owed a Honda. And the yeah, the mage up. wild shaped and yeah. was trying to take off. That's right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Drew it, but yeah. Drew it. Yes. You were outside looking in, it was hard to see. That's true. That's true. Yeah, you were just climbing across the rooftop like a terrifying nightmare. Yeah. yeah that is so creepy. It's awesome. So good. <laughs> looking through the hole in the ceiling. <laughs> just see like so full like grudge, just like hair yeah. coming yeah. down. Yeah. And, like, it's an all eye. shadow except for the one eye that's uh, all. Like, yep. Amazing. Uh, it's very, very gingy. So good. Um, <laughs> I think yeah. that concludes that round. Um, before yeah. we do whatever comes next, I don't know what comes next. I have three more ship names to propose. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay, for Imogen and Lada. Hia! <laughs> Is that a good one? I like that one a lot. Uh, okay, that's one. Uh, uh, horse and buggy? No. Uh, okay. Because she's like no. decomposing bugs? Uh, okay, Kay. sure. Or Sometimes okay. ghost rider. <gasps> Ghost Rider! That's Ghost Rider's pretty great. That's, That's good. good. That's pretty great. That's good. <laughs> I still like Horse School. Horse School is There's also good. Ghoul Ranch. <laughs> ghoul Ranch. <laughs> That's good too. Like Ghoul Ranch Doritos? Yep. I, I think he's <laughs> Yeah! Is my favorite. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hard to spell. Yeah. Um, if you go with Ghoul Ranch, then maybe people will send us Doritos instead of Werther's. <laughs> oh. It's time for another pull of the Tower of Inquiry, is that right? Yes. Oh my god, we have another pull of the...
going to fall. You're definitely going to fall. Who do I want to suffer? You. <laughs> you <laughs> God damn it. That's really good at this game. God damn it. Oh, what? I mean, Laura, I'm again really sorry for yelling at you about using two hands. I'm just really silly. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Like, I'm not the I feel biggest really rule bad. stickler with Ooh, this game. Boy, this I feel bad. not <laughs> good. Get a close up. Get a slow mo going. Oh, no. Get the phantom camera on. Oh, no. So, I kind of want the. Do the base. Do the base. The very bottom level, Matt. I know. I know. The very bottom It's funnier if you can do the so very bottom level. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. There's no way. Dissonance. He can do it. He can't do it. Matt can do anything. It's impossible. Matt can't. He's, doing impossible, it. He's doing it. He's doing it. <gasps> no way. He's doing it. Uh, doing it can't be done, done, Captain. Ah! 33. Whoa. Get out there. Oh, no. Are these glued on? No, not this time. <laughs> oh, my God. What the fuck? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Am I in like flame? Hi. In like 20 seconds when no one's around it. Yeah. Okay, so uh, from Dice Dragon 73, what has been the most heartbreaking thing that has happened to your character this season? And what was the most heartwarming thing that happened to your character this season? <sighs> well, <laughs> Deep sigh. Well, you died. Yeah. <laughs> you, you lied. It was pretty bad. Yeah. That was pretty bad. But then getting a makeup ring was pretty heartwarming. <laughs> so you dying sad. was pretty sad. Yeah, it was very sad. Making out pretty heartwarming. <laughs> 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 that was good. What about you, buddy? Oh, uh, I think learning I was a murderer is bad. Uh, this is a funny question. But uh, <laughs> falling in love with uh, oh. getting screwed by Frida was pretty good. Oh. Yeah. Screwed. Yeah. That's cute. <laughs> also gross. We're machines. Yeah, because we're machines. Why is that gross? Right. That just, just because you're gross. just because <laughs> your wiener's made out of a drill. <laughs> That's not gross. No, drill dick. What? It's true. Drill dick. He's we need a ship name. He's got a tattoo. We need a ship name. And They've it's got a tattoo. <laughs> Y'all already have a ship name. It's love letters. Oh, that's oh, true. That's, yeah. that's so good. That's true. Thank you, Dice Dragon Seventy Three. Black and Black and Decker. <laughs> Um, remember, Wait, Matt, what's the most heartwarming and, and oh, saddest yeah. thing that's happened to you as a DM this season? Uh, saddest, mm, saddest thing would be having to say goodbye to Eshteros because I really liked oh, him as an yeah, NPC, but narratively made sense. Um, heartwarming would be watching your characters come together. Honestly, oh. it was a, it was an, un, an, an unexpected, you know, romance and creation, and then watching it become the like. Rachel Ross of the campaign, where everyone's like, yeah, no, but really, like, when, when, when are you guys gonna? <laughs> oh, they're way better than Rachel and Ross. I'm oh, just that's saying. great. I'm saying oh it's like, like the longevity of everyone going, like, all right, come on. Let's do this. <laughs> Thank you, Dice Dragon seventy three. Remember, if you have a singularly saucy evergreen, singularly saucy question <laughs> for the Tower of Inquiry, you can flop those fingers on your keyboard until you create a sequence of letters and symbols that spells out critroll.com/tower. <laughs> and then press enter or return. It's like magic, only we're gonna take a quick break. <laughs> <laughs> but don't leave, because when we come back, we'll be playing Gang Beasts. Gang Beasts, nice! What is that? I don't know. You'll see. Is it a video game? <laughs> it's video yeah. game. And making costume prompts for our oh, annual yes. Fort Frighted dive. Yes. Oh, no. That's right, oh, our yes. Halloween episode is coming up. Okay, stay tuned. Whoever's gonna be on. Woo! Yeah. We'll be right back, bye. <laughs> the Midnight Queen is dead. As the bell tolls for Her Majesty, her succession looms in uncertainty. For with her dying breath, the Queen invoked an ancient and deadly contest, compelling the princesses of Twelvefold to meet in secret and battle one another, until the stroke of midnight reveals the victor the new Midnight Queen. Erdine, the Gilded Champion. Dr. Lux, the Scholar Supreme. Rosalyn, the Oneromancer. Freya, Blood of the Tower. Hephaestus, the Lightbreaker. 
And then there's me, Boss No, the fairest of them all. Who will survive? Who will you choose? Who will be Queen by Midnight? Laura Bailey here to guide you through what's new in the Critical Role Shop. Style should never be a dumpster, darling. Roll an investigation if you want. It's basically perfect. There's so many. Go ahead, darling. Treat yourself. I mean, the traveler always says impulse purchases are a good decision. Can you put donuts in this? Only one way to find out. Look at this. Isn't it fashion? So much fashion happening here. And hey, if you want, you could head over to the Critical Role shop right now. Those that rise from the trenches, only to boldly dive into the catacombs of the Fairlands are few and far between. Any investigator, be they soldier or civilian, will eventually find themselves forced to abandon what is right for what must be done. The scars of war are deep and timeless. Those who survive must balance on a delicate thread of ever-fraying purpose. For to stare too deeply into the chasm of the past is to see nothing but a reflection of terror. When retribution crawls from the darkness, our inner fortitude is put to the test. The Circle of Needle and Thread. Assignment number 533. Eye for an Eye. to season one of Midst, you're gonna want to stop here. Seriously, we'll give you three seconds. All right, you've been warned. So, you may be asking yourself, what the hell? Why the fuck did the moon explode? What's gonna happen to utterly doomed Midst and everybody trapped on it by an incoming wave of reality devouring fog? Are Lark and Zila gonna be okay? Are they gonna figure out that Sherman's not dead? What's Phineas gonna do now that he's been abandoned by the trust, the very institution that raised him and gave him purpose and his sense of self-worth and like, what is he gonna do? Will Jonas Spar do the right thing? What even is the right thing? What is Imelda's deal? Why did the trust even bother they're rescuing Mockweep, even though he's this weird sleazeball piece of shit who stabbed his closest friends in the back. And what is a mirror hawk? What is a bocular horse? What is going on with Weep's voice? Is Landlord gonna die? No. no. Okay, we, we will tell you this one. Landlord is not going to die. We're unreliable narrators, not monsters. Why did Lark kill Fuse? What is she trying to hide? Is the Nutcracker okay? Will the rapidly depreciating value of Valor ever restabilize, or is the market doomed to implode? Is the trust bad? Did Saskia's dogs really eat the melted corpse of enterprising businessman Atticus Concord? Do the narrators even know what happens next? No. We have no idea. Just kidding. We know. And when Season 2 of Midst 
unfolds August 23rd, you will know as well. In the meantime, for bonus episodes, merch, media, and more, visit midst.co. And don't forget to stock up on light bulbs. You might need them where we're going. doing this right or oh sorry um am i doing this right you can also gift subscriptions to fellow critters so what are you waiting for start spreading that sweet serenity with a twitch subscription to critical role it's like a warm blanket oh, oh hold on it's my proctologist just give me a second okay hello hello, hello? Oh, hey, hey, Doc, yeah, what, what's up? What do you mean, more teeth? I thought you got rid of them all. Well, no, you don't tell me to relax. I'm the one with teeth up my... Subscribe. Hello, and welcome back. We're doing character <laughs> selection on Four Sided Dive. I'm a little distracted. Uh, you, uh, welcome back <laughs> to Four Sided Dive. 
Uh, you guys now get to watch us mess around with a video game. We're playing a game called mm -hmm. Gang Beasts that mm -hmm. I've never played before. Classic. It's real fun looking. Uh, let's get, uh, we're going to answer some questions yes. while we do oh, it. God. I will There's be no just yelling questions at y'all during this. Okay, so let's okay. just get, get into it. We're, we're okay. picking characters. And each, everybody, everybody say which one you are once you finalize yes. so that yeah, our yeah. audience There's so many good ones. ones. A lot of options. I don't know what to pick. I love creepy pink pink old man. Is that you? Old man? That's me. Perfect. Yeah. Oh man, there's a hot minotaur. I guess I gotta be him. Oh yeah. Oh no. For, for oh, no. oh no! Oh yeah, no! I'll be. What did I do? Wait, what happened? I went away! No. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, the, I'm the minotaur man. Okay. Okay, I'm hamburger head. Hamburger head? And you're an old lady? I'm, old, I'm old lady. <laughs> <laughs> but you have to hit A, Laura. Oh shit. Okay. Okay, okay we're in, we're in. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Oh wait, I s okay. Okay, while we answer we'll questions, and really be okay, poignant, I, guys. This okay, is a yeah, show that people... That hey, this Matt, is, yeah. what was the inspiration no. behind the All Minds Burn and its alien mind? Uh, that was actually a collaboration uh, with oh. Bashir, who uh, helped me build out the Hellcatch Valley. Really? Um, yeah, and so that's, it, it was kind of like a, a little nugget of information that he threw in his build, and I just got to expand upon it and make it my own little weird thing. Awesome. Um, that's so cool. So yeah. Did I he hope. give it the name? Uh, he did, in the, origi in the original uh, document for it, so. That's so cool. Uh, so, Bashir, I hope you're watching it, I hope it's great. Whose idea was it to make them smoke up the mind? Uh, it was kind, kind of lo loosely <laughs> in the lore, and then just kind of <laughs> e expanded upon it there. <laughs> oh god, don't punch no, the old lady! Me. Oh, I got let's you, go I got you. Version. I got you. What do I, I just don't know what to, oh, no. what to do with oh, this afterwards. How do I Here, get over here. I've got somebody. Um, How do you I throw? Uh, yeah, can you? <laughs> I, I can't. I can't figure out how to gravity. <laughs> Wait, no! There's a shark. Can't get away. Let me go. <laughs> <laughs> No, get over here. No! Get over here. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, so you can get them up, but then what do you do with them when you're holding them? Oh, oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> Delilah is confirmed to be back. How is Laudna feeling yeah, now that she has that voice back in her head? To know that she didn't get rid of her. No! No, no! You know? Wait! Just. Just like oh with Gang Beasts, we're just gonna roll with the punches <laughs> and see what happens. We're gonna... Is there know. any sort of like <laughs> sense of like, I yes. knew it? No. Or I think I already, <laughs> wait, what the fuck is with the shark? No. Yeah, go to <laughs> launch it! Question was not finished. <laughs> oh. They're just gonna have to watch so it by now. <laughs> watch Critical Role, well, you guys. What's the question? D Delilah. Some Delilah oh, stuff. We need more Delilah in this campaign. Wait, she's back, baby. I want, I want her back. She never left. She never left. Is that true? Uh, yeah, she's got yeah. diminished heavily. Diminished heavily. Uh -huh. <laughs> get, no, 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 get no, out here, get no. Out of here. Wait, oh, wait, no. wait, 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 I can't get out of here. symbol of his oh. guilt about Dancer and the Division. I think it was the moment that everyone was waiting for in this campaign. <laughs> uh, oh I actually, my God. I actually did feel, it felt really good to have closure there. Right. And I think that- It was very symbolic. It right? was, it was, at least for, for my character it was symbolic. I don't know if anyone else really gave a shit, no. but, no. but no. I, I'm, I think here, FCG is even. very, no. actually really happy about it. No, no. And it might actually lead to new choices no. in the game. Get over here! Nope. Wait, really? <laughs> no one oh, will. Oh, no, no, no one will engage me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, wait, no! Get off this train. No, 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 what happened? Wait, Sam, we're stuck in the crack. Look at that, another draw. We're so good at this, y'all. Oh so we've had more win and two draws. Okay. Correct. We're never the the game's like, this. no one scored <laughs> again. We don't know how to do anything. Uh, oh, we're doing point. great, yeah. It's, it's, hey, fumble, it's fumble core. It's hey, best. Laura. Yeah. Imogen's encounter with her Rylora was much more intense this time due yes. to it being far more corporeal. How does she feel about her connection with these beings? Is she worried she is turning into one? Uh, I don't think she's worried she's turning into one. Like, no, let go. No. Let go. No, 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 no. No, no, no. She's not worried she's no. turning into one. You, you, <gasps> no. Yes. No. 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 Um, I don't think she's turning into one, but she is worried that her powers are, are like, she, shit is happening. Mm -hmm. I don't think she's afraid she's gonna, like, But what her, are her those things? Are they aliens? Were they created? And they were born on the moon. And you can summon like, them? I? I almost just... Oh, jeez. Oh my god, this seems Wait. dangerous. Oh! oh! <laughs> Laura, too! Wow. We all fell right into that. <laughs> Yeah, everyone on Laura. Oh no! <laughs> this is, we, we, we were only doing four rounds, so we might have oh. to do another one. No, it's four wins. Four wins. Four First wins. person to four wins. Oh, jeez. Okay. Enjoy beef. Okay. Hey, Sam. Yes. Though you all eventually chose to go see I'm Dancer. I'm already dead! <laughs> Sorry. Uh, you all eventually chose to go see Dancer instead of D. Do you hope to run into D in the future? Does really? FCG have any interest in speaking yeah. to D? That was I so do. Cool. Yes. I do uh. want to see uh, D in the future. I do want to see D in the future because I think I'll I'll learn more, especially about uh, my my old world origins. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm worried slightly that my the origins that I've been designed to do might come back and haunt me in the future. I don't, I don't know, no, I don't know oh, what really? might happen. No, but. Oh, oh, yeah, no, it's valid. That's karma. Get over here. Get over here. Get over here. Fuck off. Oh, 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 I think it's B? Or do you hold the you hold bumpers? Them in the B or oh, I didn't know that. Okay. <laughs> it's fine. I have no points. <laughs> <laughs> You'll get there. But yes, D, I think, is going to be fascinating. And I just don't know. I guess we can go visit them whenever we want to. We just have to figure mm -hmm. out where they are. Menagerie Coast. <laughs> Not yes. very helpful. That's a very large area. Hey, Matt. Yes. Why did you decide oh, to put Graz Char in the game? Well, I got your Which hat. came first? <laughs> the desire to explore the Grey Valley or to give Travis another no! curse? No! No! <laughs> no! Do that? I just got <laughs> dropped into a. No! Oh. I refuse to oh. die! Wait, I refuse to die! <laughs> <laughs> no! No! I'm, no. I'm, I'm running and hiding. <laughs> Stop it! Leave the grandma alone. I, I wanted to take him to the Grey Valley first. And then I, I, I can't, I'm not letting go. <laughs> you guys, I'm gonna hold on to this wall. No. Good luck. No! 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 Get in there! Release the granny! Get in there! Get in there! Get in there! Get in there! No! The burger is mine. Oh, I want to go. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! 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 I'm being hooked by a minotaur. No! Oh my god. So yeah, I brought I brought, I brought him to the Great Valley first, no. and then oh, my god. I thought about it, and I was like, we no. put this in the Saldori guide, and and I honestly, my thought was. I'm interested to see how anybody else in the group would act with a with a sentient weapon, and somehow it still ended up with Travis. Back. Destiny. It was oh, Destiny. No. I was like, I'm interested to see how Ashton would do with this. Yeah. I'd be curious to see with with its intent and personality if even Orm would touch it slightly, mm -hmm. uh, just for a moment. And, and 
No, I just went straight to Travis. No. I, it, no. Oh, 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 oh my god, I'm so Uno reverse, no, Uno no, reverse. No, Uno reverse. How do you do it? I'm not going down. I'm not going down. <laughs> Where's the shark? Oh, get him! Oh, get him! Oh, How do you throw? Oh, yes! God. Yes! No! Get him! Laura! Wait! Wait! Stay! Wait! Please stay down! Stay down! No. Hey, Laura! Imogen mentioned the possibility that she could give in to the feeling of being connected to Rudis rather than resist it. Does she want to give in and see what happens, or is that a last resort? I think, um, oh God. I don't think, she, well, it is tempting to give in to see what the full, the full power would look like. But what would it do to her? Exactly, but more than anything, I think she wants to be able to get that insight that she's been lacking. Knowledge is power. Yeah, so I don't know. I think if it happens again, she might just give in. Stay in, stay in. Oh my stay God. In. This is a never ending round. <laughs> no, it's amazing. I believe in you, Sam. I believe in you. How do I get them over? Get in there. If this ends in a draw, I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> throw no. him in, throw him in, Sam. Come on. No. I don't know how. Get. <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I like hey, that his hair is like. Yeah. <laughs> this is like the longest time we've spent in Zephyr on stream. Is it? How does it feel to experience the city more in depth as Laudna in your head, but with Keyleth in your heart? Oh, it's so fun seeing Zephyr. She's <laughs> gonna. Um, <laughs> yes, I, does the city live up to your to your imagination? It does. Well, I got you, Gretch. I'm going to get in there. Yes. Oh, no. no. Oh, my gosh, it's a minotaur. Fucking throw in the wall. Get in the wall. I don't care who wins now. Just somebody do it. Get in the no. No. <laughs> uh, get in the get <laughs> off. Wait, no. <laughs> no. no. Oh my, oh my god! Oh my god! We're gonna get oh no. timed out. If it's a draw again, how do you throw oh. someone? You just have to get. yank them over. Lift them up. No! We're going down. <laughs> we're both going down. You headbutting them. I'll headbutt you back. <laughs> no! I'm Let's not go. letting go. <laughs> I'm not letting go. What if this was how Titanic ended with Jack and Rose? I gotta get out of here! I gotta get out of here! All of that for a draw! Oh I'm physically sweating. Good. Oh my god. Oh my god. I know, buddy. It's oh. intense. Hi, oh. Hey, Omar. Sam. Omar. Yes. What a question for right now. How did FCG feel accompanying Orem to Will and Derek's grave oh, sites? Oh, this will be a fast one. Oh. Oh. I feel like we got... We got some good insight into Orem's uh, family life and history, but also, oh God, uh, but also, uh, you know, it's, it's so sad. And I feel like FCG wanted to say something in that moment, but didn't really quite know what to say because we, we don't really know Will or Derek. We just know that they were important to Orem. Yes. I wish I could know them more because they were so important no, no, no. to Orem and we don't really know much about them. Get off of me. Get off of me. Get off of me. Throw. Joy, okay. throw. <laughs> Get, Get off of me. Oh, 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 oh. This is my building. <laughs> you don't belong here. <laughs> no, I didn't take a nap. <laughs> oh my God. You're going to win. You're going to win. You're going to do it. Oh boy. I don't the know. What's funniest <laughs> about that? That Orem grave scene. Funny. Funny? Well, oh my god. <laughs> I, you, I gotta finish my thought. Was that like at the same like if we do this for the animated the eventual Bell's Hells animated series? Yes. It would be intercut with Chetney and Laudna uh dog fighting in the sky. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> Over that top of the grave. Oh hey, Marcia, there's actually a question in here. How did you feel about your dog fight? It was so good. How did you enjoy your sky you know, I will say those call signs were terrible. <laughs> yes, they, yeah. 
Oh, you're you're up with them. God damn it. Good. They were uh, terrible. Yeah. No. Come on, come on. Yeah. I mean, Matt came up with them on the they spot. Both out there. Girls, oh, get, the, get off, get, get off, yeah. get off. Get out of here. Granny, why don't you no. both off a ride? No, 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 Get no, rid no. of that burger. Oh, 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 get out. No! Oh. Oh, you did it, Sam. I did it. You all forgot about me. <laughs> you and Dre, every time. Hey, Omar. Don't rip up the carpet. Uh. Don't do it. Hey, uh, Matt. Yo. We kind of talked about this a little bit. <laughs> what was the deal with Shithead slash Gargo? Who did he belong to and why did FC FCG upset him so? That's was deep, he a revenant? It's deep lore, I can't discuss it. That's <laughs> fair. <laughs> was he a revenant though? He, yeah. The bird, the bird was Pretty a revenant? Pretty much, uh, more or less. Like uh, his previous master was, was, was a, a, a necromancer of, of some repute. <laughs> and when the master was gone, they were kind of lost and locked in this perpetual undying state and cursed to roam the land. And then one day they found a shiny person and really just hated him. <laughs> and spent the rest of their you know, recent days trying to, oh, ow. Hey, it, oh, what? That wasn't water's fine edge. down Why here. Are you still in the game? Oh, water's fine down here. The edge? There were a bunch of old questions from like four sided oh. dives past in here. No. So that's why I was throwing some out because they were very old. Oh, and wait, so they're very strange. So. You can keep, you can ask no, some they're, oldies. They're, not, they would, they're things we had talked about let me and go. weren't valid anymore that we had talked about an old four sided dive. No, <laughs> let me go! Let me go! Wait, wait Laura's got a hold of me. I'll just let think of it some more. Things. Chain of bodies. Stop it. No. I'm going to pull you off. No, 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 no. I'm going to take it off. No. No! I will go into this room no, no, no. and you will leave me alone. I want to go to bed. It's past my bedtime. Hi. You want to come up here? Hey, uh, Imogen and Laudna, how excited are y'all to tell Shadana about your relationship <gasps> upgrade? Oh, I think Shadana <laughs> thought we were in a relationship this whole time. I, I think Shadana did would literally too. be how like, when Bree and I would be able to tell people, oh, we're dating now. People would be like, wait, you were? Uh-huh. <laughs> Yeah, we know. Yeah. Nope. So the fire's you for you, know. Granny. We've been staying in the same room this whole time. Get, oh, <laughs> shit. That's on you. Oh, I'm saying. Uh, All right. We oh, got my God. Oh, this is I never going to end. Nope. <laughs> so good. Lighthouse. What, other, what, oh, other, what else we got? What's this? Laura. Oh. Imogen's opinion of the gods seems to have adjusted since her visit to the Grey Valley. I talked about this already. Where she saw the demons running rampant. Oh, you we're don't get, fighting. Go away. This, you don't understand my system, Sam. Shoot. <laughs> away from my questions. I am picking up more. Oh my gosh. Come here, burger. No. You come here. No. <laughs> no. Good, Gran Granny. Ugh. Get off of my lighthouse. <laughs> you didn't get invited. Hey Matt, what's up with the Dawnfather? Ooh, the yeah. Dawnfather has been at the core bad. of all he's kinds of stuff. What is the deal he's with the Dawnfather? He's not bad. Look, all the gods have had their their entire existence suddenly threatened, and they're in a, they're in a really odd, rock and a hard place scenario. And some people listen to. Oh, oh that's God, on me. You just fell to your own death. I did. I did. That was incredible. Yeah, I was like, oh. <laughs> Granny's got bad eyes. Like, she oh didn't my, notice him falling out of the window. It's safe again. I'm like, <laughs> I will throw you. Ah! I'm like, let go. Get off. Get off. Yes. 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 <laughs> Look, de desperate circumstances make even gods act a little out of the ordinary. Very desperate, yeah. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Oh my God, Marisha's she's gonna win. Is my God sending the best missionaries God? out to uh, do to Hearthdale? I do, and that's all you need. But you know what? I haven't actually learned anything about her. You have not. Uh, should you I? Went, you went into yeah, a Mobius, temple and had the, a coin. The Lord of the Hells situation will be very interesting <laughs> if uh, the Changebringer finds out about that. I imagine. Bad history. Oh God. Oh yeah. Oh God. That's I'm the Changebringer and the Lord like of the Hells. Are really really <laughs> They're like each other's mortal enemies. Really? Yeah. No, 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 no. So, no. so no, I, no, I, no, no, oh, oh, I, I have to hate oh, Lauren now? Okay. I mean, I sure, if that's how I see Oh, God! Oh, God! Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I can make it! I can make it! Oh, wow. Maybe I should ask the change bringer about the Lord of the Hells. <laughs> That's a little metagamey, but I'll do it anyway. I... <laughs> yes, because you famously love to metagame. 
Well, <laughs> it's not that metagamey. I mean, we know that yeah. Fern got yeah, involved exactly. with... Hey, with... Changebringer, hey, change what do you think of no, uh, no. Devils? Hey, CD. <laughs> Wait, how do you know this one? <laughs> so like that a, was a joke, Sam, because I, you, I you're very anti-medicating. I know I am. I, go I, know. Make, I, fi I figured that. I just, I just, just, I'm explaining just it for, extremely for the people, violent. just in case. No, 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 no. Get up, get up. Go hug me, Grandma. Get out of the way. Get That's it. Get over. No. No. I'm just no. 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 Over. Head. Over. Hey, Marisha. Yeah. Uh, Locker has not uh, commented on the fact that the lightning marks are spreading up Imogen's body. Has she? Ha does she have <laughs> thoughts about the it. lightning marks? <laughs> um, no, 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 no. no. Y'all are y'all forgetting mean, about Dre again. <laughs> no, Shit. no, 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 no. Hey, I'm your friend. I'm your friend, yeah. friend Jess. <laughs> I think I'm literally caught in between the ropes. Hey. Yeah. Oh. Wait, is that it? I think once you go I out on this it, one. We'll the ring. Oh, goodness. Nope, 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 nope. Let me go. See, Let me go. Let me go. Sure. Oh. I really thought was... Been having the, the fear. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, God. Um, I, I feel like Laudan has also for sure had the thought of like. Is Imogen slowly here. turning into a right Lauren? Is she, yeah, because you're the one who asked that. I, I think I'm like I think I'm I don't that. think she's so, turning into one. I think you could Although be, I though. am slowly getting more and more red, so. Yeah, what do you think that is? Are you getting red? Oh, getting, like, God, so close. Your skin is turning like red tones? Oh, yeah, where uh, it used to be like purple lightning. Uh, it's turning. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. Just, uh, no, 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 no. Don't eat, don't eat the tape. Don't eat the pork, Omar. Get out of my house. No. Maybe this is the worst episode of the worst time. <laughs> it's the best. It's really fun. We're great. Get. <laughs> oh my God. Let go. Take off with you. No, 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 no. Oh God. Get out, get out, get out. No. Yes. Uh, <laughs> damn it. How did I slip through there? Oh. I kind of want Sam. Oh. I got to three win. stars. Yes. It's anyone's game at this oh point. Oh my god! I kind of want Sam to win because I don't think he's ever won a video game in his life. I know. <laughs> Which is why I must destroy him. Oh no! Oh, we're, we're, this is bad. This is. No! Are you fucking serious? <laughs> no. Yay! Yay! Just stay alive, Yay. Matt. Just stay alive. Come get me! Come get me! <laughs> this game is awesome! <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just taking, I'm just taking a nap. <laughs> oh, no, no, there it is. <laughs> Yay! Can you do like the one fist bump in the air, like Breakfast Club? <laughs> This is it. This is for the, this is for everything. This is for the win. This is for the title. <laughs> Wait, we're all tied now. We're all tied. Uh, no, no, no. You just won. You just won. No, no, okay, I was no, one behind. No, no, no. I was one behind. Oh. You just oh, won everything. Did I win? Oh. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Oh my god. Yep. I got it. Oh my god. I think you won last year too. To Did create I win the, last year? To create the 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 best costume. Oh my god. Costume. Oh my god. Oh my god. That game wow. was amazing. That was so fun. Congratulations to Marisha. But before we go, it's, <laughs> it's recently come to our attention that the next four sided dive will be our second four frighted dive. Yes. The Halloween special. Last year, we had the cast dress up in costumes made from a few randomly selected words, and then poof, Matt's garbage robot broke the internet and our hearts. I was a robot. It was such a good <laughs> robot. So, what the heck? Let's just do it again. Danny, do you have those cauldrons? You do. 
Um, each of us will pull one. Episode surprise. Okay. I was ready. Each of us will pull one creature, and then a word that will flavor the creature. However, Marisha, you got uh, since you got the most points uh, in Gang Beasts, you get to pick three of each and make your pick. own. Okay. And whoever won. Um. Oh. But don't tell us. I was going to say, I kind of don't right? want to tell you. The oh, so you get. Right. You save to the end. You save okay, to the okay. End. Yeah. And then you put your. Oh, but I can put it. Should I choose and then put them back? Go ahead and look through. And then as you're doing it, if you want to throw some more in, you can. And then I just okay. choose random? Yeah. And whatever you get is whatever what it I is. Draw. Yes. Okay. Ooh, oh my god, you guys. <laughs> oh wait. Well, this I think has got to be Liam has to be on the next. No wait, episode, I've already this picked has it. To be. Here, let me okay. put some back. These I've are the three jacks. creatures. I don't like it, but maybe it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you had halfling luck, you could roll again. Mm, he's not gonna use That's it. That's cheap. There's one of each. Yeah. Cheap. And I will also pick. Yay! Do we announce what they are? When? Give me a second. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Give me a second. <laughs> Who goes first? You okay. Uh, Matt, go first. Alien party. <laughs> party alien. Party alien. <laughs> <laughs> I like alien party. I know. It yeah. could be a whole bunch of <laughs> I'm saying it's open to interpretation. Honestly, that's kind of funny. You I'm here for dress alien. as a disco floor and then just have An a bunch alien of... alien party, yep. That's funny. I think this is witch professor or Ooh. professor witch. Ooh. Witch professor. I want to yeah. do that one. Professor witch? Witch, witch professor. No, witch, am I a professor, professor who though. teaches witchcraft? Yeah. Or am I a witch oh. who teaches women's studies? <laughs> <laughs> It's I'll, up to you. Really. I'll go last since I put mine. Together. Yes. I got a uh, New Jersey Swamp Monster. <laughs> no, amazing. <laughs> Which is why I said Liam yeah. has to be. Yeah. That is That's so great. good. Yeah. yeah. Isn't that just Snooky though? <laughs> <laughs> I got Luxury Puppy. Oh, oh Luxury oh, Puppy is great. Oh, great. <laughs> um, I put together. Thirst Trap Waluigi. Oh! oh. That, is the, that is the greatest. Nice. That is the greatest. Oh wow. my god. So someone's gonna be oh sexy Waluigi. <laughs> Incredible. Wow. Oh, who's it gonna I be? I love it. Holy as soon as shit. I saw it, I knew. That's amazing. Oh, Beautiful. Now we all have it's something great. to look forward to. We do. We, do. Um, we will be assigning those costumes at random to the forecast. Oh, these aren't ours? No, well, no. it's whoever's on next. Oh, they so, so they have ours. to wear these. Yeah. Yeah, last I mean, year I was an art school demon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You were a dinosaur. Disco dino? A disco right, dino. Yeah. Garbage robot. I was a garbage robot. <laughs> Travis was a laser werewolf. Yeah. Yep. And I was a 90s mermaid. Yep. Amazing. You look great. Um, uh, we'll assign these uh, for the folks on the next episode of Foresight of Dive. That's all the time we have for tonight. Thank you, Marisha, Laura, and Matthew. And uh, as always, our lore keeper, Danny Carr. Woo! And I guess it's time to time to clean up after everyone. Is that is that my job? Yes. yes. Your job. Okay. Hit that music and let's get to cleaning, uh, shall we? Clean up your stuff. Hit, hit the hit the tape deck that plays my voice singing a song. There's well, Mopo. Turn the lights. Oh, are you gonna I have sing to mop a clean up? up? I thought Omar you were gonna sing us a clean up song. Where's Omar? Where's Over here. Is Over there. Something like around the try. table. Everybody <laughs> thing with the thing with the charm of a bars. It makes a lot of gaze with the theme of the same, and then it goes a banana bees. So let yourself be there for this. <laughs> Everybody, come on, take a boot. Yeah, one by one, we do the do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We're the oh, ones that smile the good. I hear the jumping Everybody, <laughs> take a thing, all right. The ones that smile take a drive. Get off, kids! <laughs> The way when you make a Yes, creepy plastic Santa. Soon you'll get what you want, and I'll get what I want. What I've always wanted.